Hello, hello, hello. Let me know if anyone's here. Oh, what's good, Incromancer, Truby, Styrofoam Peace, Rafa Gaming, Clorox Chewable, Haunted Heart, Ataki. Just want to play Viddy Games, Penguin, Matoko Double Underscore K, Peditis, Mary Peepee, Oh No, It's Mega Fat, Crumbly Bits, My Dad is Not a Phone, The 99, Repu Plums, Commando Walrus, The 9th, Monochrome Guardian, Mad Kate King, Fox Box, Seamus the Toidle, The Joycraft, Half Talon, Rookstar underscore, The underscore Nacho underscore man, Caracal underscore Mark II. Merry weekend, everybody. Hello. What's good, Matt Mag and Cipharoni? I had one drink today and I already feel my fingers going numb. Am I okay? I think your liver might be shot. What's good, Cipharoni? Uh, Black Royland, Captain Teampo. Thank you, Mr. Mars, for the 40 month resub. I appreciate it. Thank you, Empty Perspective, also for the 40 months. What's good, Tolo and Chat? Merry weekend, dudes. Yeah, happy Hanukkah. Hello, Absolute Scrub, Ghost by Go. Haunted Harp, thank you for the 22 month resub. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Hello, Princess Cutie by Damien's, Tally Tenenbaum, Dragon Ball Z 432. Pyroman, Lunar Chaos, Gray Sketch. Thank you, Sadowskovich, for the 45 months. What's up, dude? Hello, Techno Pandas, Slave, Captain Crow, Kaleidio, Crumbly Bits, Paul Omega, Castly, Cherizer, Genso Kaizo, Chippy, AEF, BCB. Are we going to learn how to degrease pizza again? Maybe. Hello, streamer. Would you please react harder? <laughs> I, I hope you guys picked good videos. I hope this isn't going to be disappointing. I'm going to judge you for your videos tonight. So you're all on the chopping block if you submitted a video. Uh, hello, Torpal Duck, Coffee Dude, Nezerat, Kalink, Complete Rebel, Salatair, Tolomeo Sun, Nargle, King the God Slayer, uh, Kangler the Toad Slayer. It's going to be very disappointing. It might be. But that's part of the fun. I hope you send nothing but embarrassing cringe videos. <laughs> that's that's what I'm hoping for. Uh, <laughs> that's my favorite kind of video. Like, awful fucking videos that are just, like, absolutely miserable. Um, I'm, I, I saw one. It was, like, a, like, defending blood on the dance floor. That one looked good. I'm looking forward to that one. Hello, Wilt King. I sent in a wacky video called Mr. Hands. I hope it's funny. Me too. Hello, Rafa. Can we watch the priest crumpling a child tonight? We watched that the other night. That's what that's what inspired this. Are the submissions still open? Kind of. It depends if Otterbug feels like sifting through them. Hello, Ashland. Uh, bees in my eyes. Where's the titty rat wizard? I guess I guess we need to bring that uh, as like a permanent fixture, huh? Because now everyone's going to be asking me where the, where the huge titted rat is every single stream. So here it is. I'm sure you missed it all very much. Uh, let, me, let me go ahead and... There you go. Right above Whataburger. Hello, Spyro. Um, Avin. Shrink it down to barely visible. When is the start? It's a long queue. When I feel like it, Ildaka. I could feel like it in five minutes. I could feel like it in two hours. You never know. It's part of the appeal. Thank you, bees in my eyes, for the sub. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. And enjoy the emotes. For the rat wizard. Okay. Fair enough. Hello, abyssal spirit. T-Dog Uber Organ Mancer emote was too much, but that there is fine. Yeah. We're gonna we're gonna get rid of all of the emotes and just replace it with pieces of that huge titted rat. All of the emotes have to go. Now we need a manly muscle wizard rat. I'm just kidding. I wouldn't do that. But that would be kind of funny. Oh. God damn, I love Diet Coke. Also, I have a picture to show you today that's unrelated to titty, titty rats. I haven't, I haven't shown pictures of my, my yog in a while. So this was, this was taken today. Look at, look at, look at her. Look at how happy she is. Nice yog. Thank you, dude. Whose toes are those? 
This brings joy, so fluffy, yeah. Yeah, she's... She's getting up there. Seven years old this year. What's going on, Kiwi Syrup? Nice pile of shit behind the dog. That's a towel. Uh, Yowie Toes? Where... What the fuck are you talking about? What do you mean, Yowie Toes? Alright, there's my Yogg. What the fuck is that thing in the top left? Uh, that's the Rat Woman, Kitsune. Don't you like it? I sent a very important video to the channel. It's under my alt account. Why the fuck do you have an alt account for Discord? What's wrong with you? The French Stinkler. Oh, it can't have copyrighted music in it. I, that should be okay because it's in New Vegas, but just as a general rule of thumb. Um, woman? It is a woman. Look at her. Isn't she beautiful? It's the most beautiful rat woman you've ever seen. Don't you fucking lie to me. Don't pretend. Oh, God. What's going on, Hydrophilic Toaster? Splitting. I ate, like, 15 granola bars just now. Um, I report that image to Twitch. There's nothing wrong with that image. A little cannon shout. I'm gonna have to wink it right now, in fact. They have a sweet bulge. Hello, Malone Fox underscore. Looking very breedable. I ate a shit ton of fajitas at a Mexican restaurant. Nice. Nice, dude. I just suddenly got the urge to eat right right before stream, and I just I shoved fucking granoli bars into my mouth. Do you order curbside? No. Not usually. The only thing wrong with that image is that I can't see the huge food of cock. Understandable. Where is Misa Coco? Um, that's a good fucking question. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to ping her in Discord. We're gonna start doing that to people. If you're in the Discord, we're gonna we're gonna fuck with you. If you're not at the stream, uh, thank you, West Gray Fox, for the twenty three month resub. I appreciate it. I owe you for the unsub months. No, you don't. You don't owe me anything. Can she do one of those incredible rat tricks from the picture below? Maybe. Hello, Jess Long. Jeff, Jeff. Every day right before I go to work, I inhale like four granola bars. What kind of granola bars do you like? We like the peanut butter ones. Hello, something hill zone. That do it. Thank you, McB, for the 37 months. I appreciate it. How are you, dude? Oh, hello. Sock in a jar. Pinning a mama. I miss a mama. I hope he's okay. I had one of those margaritas with the beer sticking out of it. My sister fucking loves those. She talks about them all the time. It's so funny. That's like, that's the key to her heart are fucking margaritas with the beer inside. The upside down one. Chocolate chip, peanut butter's good too. Nice. Hello, Chrysan. Every time I see an army man on the toilet, I think of a modder. How often do you see army men on the toilet, Incromancer? Are you a peeping Tom next to a fucking military base? What the fuck do you mean? How often does that situation pop up in your life? Is a mama in the military? No. I don't believe so. Uh, hello, tentacle rat. I really like the honey oats nature valley granola bars, especially dipped in yogurt. I don't like the yogurt ones very much. But the regular honey oat ones are good. Mr. Stream, the stream title has me feeling personally attacked. Why? Hello, Misa Coco. Fartballs 69,420. Farrick. I like that video of the guy flipping off his mom and she beats the shit out of him. See, this is what we do. You guys, I, I have to admit to you, you've all been scammed. I've, I've, I've rubed you. See, you came here thinking that you were going to get videos. Well, I have bad news for you. I have bad news for you, dog. I'm just going to play Legends of Eidolon for, for 500 fucking years. You're going to watch me chop this tree for seven hours. We're not going to play video games. We're not going to watch videos. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I just have that running in the background. Um, thank you, Alawichu, for the 44-month resub. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. He's finally playing his idol game. Get the Megalodon again? I already have nine of them, Ildaka. 
that username, Holy God. My name is Sussy Bussy Boy. What's what's wrong with that? It's a good name. What? You're picking on my name now? Mega Long Dong. I remember when I got my cookie clicker phase. Dude, I've played that at least five different times. I love those games. I'm I'm rodent minded. That shit's like crack. Can you play as one of those carrots? No, that's the dumbest thing I've ever heard. Why would you ever want to play as a carrot? It's perfect for the game. Last idle game I played was Doge Miner. Dude, that sounds fucking god awful. I played this one called Mr. Mine a few months ago. That was fun for like a day. Tolo's already a vegetable, it's true. Sussy Shrussy Boy would be Hubert's username. Always thinking about Hubert, huh? Uh, thank you, Akiro, for the 35 months. Thank you, thank you. I haven't seen the puzzle piece furry in a while. What did you do to him? He fucking... He, um... I think his name on Twitch is Aetherius Vivo. I see him every once in a while. Not too often. It turns out that furries who just want to do nothing but post images of, of sentient puzzle pieces don't seem to come to my stream very often. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. Hello, Oops All Towers. How are you? Uh, hello, Samantha Dashing. The username reminds me of the dude in this chat who once talked about artificial wombs for a bussy. Yeah, there's some crazy shit. Giselle came back. I always knew he would. I told you. Like, when, when he first disappeared... I said he would come back. You just need to give a man space sometimes. You know? I understand that you missed him. I missed him too. But sometimes you just need to go... You need to go on a journey of self-discovery. Wasn't he only gone for like a month? A month is an eternity in internet time. Can you imagine how pissed people would be if I streamed or did not stream for a month straight? I've gotten pretty close, <laughs> but... It, like, a month is a long fucking time. What's going on, Too Lazy 4H? A month is like six years in internet time, it is. My poor baby dog got bit inside his ear by a mosquito, so I had to rub it for him since he can't read shit. Oh, wow. You're nice to your dog, that's good. Hello, Nurgle. My favorite streamer goes too much. You're saying I'm not your favorite one? What the fuck? You're here every night, and I'm not your fucking favorite? You have the audacity to say that to me? My feelings. I'm wounded. What's going on, Dizma? Let the man breathe. Give pup pets and streams once and goes on a long month break again. Uh, sounds like a loser. What's going on, Jizzy Elf? How are you, dude? Oh, you know I can't type for shit. Me neither. I type like a fucking drunk. Constantly. It's great. What's going on, Noodle? I also have this weird tick. Like, I think it's because Captain Crow has been in my chat for so long. Sometimes I mean to type out my and I say me. <laughs> Which, I sound like a, a pirate sometimes for no, for no reason whatsoever. Got bit by a mosquito on his dick and I had to rub and suck it because he has arthritis and can't reach it. Oh, well, that's that's... I don't think that's what you're supposed to do. I do that too, holy shit. Or a normal British person. Man, a lot of people are, are suck dog dick, apparently. And by a lot, I mean too. Um, <laughs> I, I think Upsal Towers was probably referring to the, the, the pirate speak thing I was saying. Not the dog dick sucking thing. Um, but I guess you never know. If a person calls me muffin, is that an insult or a compliment? It depends on who is who is saying it to you. If I called you muffin, it would absolutely unequivocally be insulting. If you go to Denny's at two in the morning and some nice old lady calls you muffin, I would I would take that as a compliment. Just a sweet little old lady, you know. Um, so it really depends on who's calling you muffin. You ever mix whiskey and hypnotic and then you feel like you're drinking a bush that has been defiled by some blueberries? Yes. I love hypnotic. That shit's good. Oh, my little cum muffin. I have seen muffin used as good. Denny's at 2am like a war zone depending where. I know, dude, I've never been to Waffle House, but I imagine like the first time I decide to go into Waffle House, I'm going to get mugged. Um, I'm looking forward to it. I'm excited. Maybe I could live stream it. Live stream going to Waffle House in the ghetto. 
<laughs> that, that would probably be a good stream. Uh, I like it when they call you sweetheart. Nobody calls me that. I find it that old ladies that work at Denny's or Waffle House with them are the sweetest old ladies. Yeah, because it's it sucks. Like, and honestly, in my opinion, in a just world, there would be no old ladies working at Denny's at three in the morning because they're probably working because they need to put their kid through fucking school or get their grandkids shit. Um, there are some people who need to work and feel feel at a loss without working. So that's not everybody. But it actually really bums me out when I see someone that old working at, like, Denny's or some shit. Um, it shouldn't be that way. In a just world, there would be no Denny's at all. You're right. You're absolutely right. You got me. That was good. What's going on, Nicholas Ayers Mendy? Uh, Gravedigger Dampy, thank you, Artemis2799, for the 19-month resub. I appreciate it. I don't mind franchise diner food. I have, okay, in the, the last couple of weeks, I've been really pissing people off with my food takes. I'm actually about to drop the worst one. Are you ready? What's going on, Visku? <clears throat> are, are you ready? I, I, I feel like this is going to be extraordinarily unpopular. I don't know for a fact if it will be. But on any given day, I would much rather eat at a franchise than almost all mom and pop places. I like franchises. I think they're good. Maybe the places that are mom and pop here just suck. But I would much rather eat at like a fucking Chili's than some random hole in the wall. Because almost always the hole in the wall, in my experience, is like the same fucking price, less food, undercooked. And it has to be because they can't compete against the the... You know the giant corporate chains. I think it depends, but I kind of agree. And I think it's, I think it's, it doesn't make you an interesting person to say you hate chain restaurants. <laughs> that's 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 my my hot food take. I'm now pissed off for entirely subjective reasons. I shall rejoin when I'm off work. All right, nipple. Because every time you talk about liking a chain, someone's like. Especially with pizza. You talk about like Domino's or something. It's like, just go to a mom and pop place, Tolomeo. Uh, I would agree, except in areas like the Barria. Sure, it depends on where you are. Um, the ones I have here are not very good in my experience. A lot of hole-in-the-wall shops around here were great, but COVID... That's true. Yeah. Yeah, it's a nightmare to be like a small restaurant owner with COVID. There you got a menu of chicken or more chicken, nice and simple. If a place does something unique, then yeah, but if it does the same food as a chain, then I'm 80% more likely to go there. New York has good mom-and-pop places, especially pizza. Only hole in the wall I know about gives great blowjobs. I knew once I, I saw you comment again, your, your comment was going to turn into something sexual. I like it. I like you. The ones I have here are pretty fantastic. Lots of choices, which is awesome. We have really good mom and pop breakfast place. That's really, yeah, that place is awesome. I like that place. It's way better than Denny's IHOP. But by and large, I would prefer the chains. There was a huge upward transfer of wealth during COVID, especially from small business to chains. Hello, armpit. My hand was bitten by a spider and is all swollen, so I have to type with one hand. Do you want me to suck it? Hello, flame resistant. I found a neat hole in the wall around Reno, served up a great euro. There's a place called Paladin's Pizza. Do you get to play D&D &D at Paladin's Pizzas? What the fuck is that? I'm in a five-day lockdown. That's okay. You weren't going anywhere anyways. How the frick can a religious chicken only having place not have good chicken? What the fuck? Dude, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. I fucking hate Chick-fil-A. I'll amend my statement. Chick-fil-A is dog shit. Fuck that place. That's the worst chain. I fucking... I fucking hate Chick-fil-A. Um... It pisses me off. Their chicken is too goddamn sweet. It's gross. What's going on, Crows 1? Hole in the wall restaurants or a crap shoot though? It's either grandma food or more rats in the deep fryer. More Chick-fil-A for me. I don't understand why me and Torpo like each other. We literally have the opposite opinion on anything. There's like nothing we fucking agree on. I think Morrowind's the best. He thinks Oblivion's the best. I think Kingdom Hearts is for fucking invalids. He loves Kingdom Hearts. I think Dragonite looks like a cuckold. Um, and he thinks Dragonite is baller. Fucking, and now, now this shit, he loves Chick-fil-A and I hate it. 
So why? I don't understand. What's going on, Lululand? How are ya? Chick Fil A today, and it was banging. Only thing I like from there are their waffle fries. I think Panda Express is pretty good. I don't. Okay. <laughs> I only eat a couple of things from Chinese places. I like orange chicken. Um, that's about it. You like the only thing there that is dog shit? You think waffle fries are dog shit? What the fuck is wrong with you? Cifferoni, if I ever meet you in real life, I'm going to break into your house and piss on your carpet. Fuck you. Fuck you and the tricycle you rode in on. What the fuck is wrong with you? Hello to Tommy. What's up? How have you been? This is my go-to at takeout. That shit's good too. Voodoo. Waffle fries are low tier? How do you not like waffle fries? How... Do you hate potato wedges too? What's good, Eve Juzel? Gonna have Chinese food and Japanese food tomorrow? I don't know what to say. That's one of the most preposterous things I think I've ever I've ever heard. I had bone and ribeye steak for the first time and oh my it was delicious. I, I'm glad you liked it. It's good, right? Fuck potato wedges? Oh my god. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna go to bed tonight crying, thinking about Cifferoni and how she's drank so much. Hard liquor that she can't even appreciate french fries anymore. What the fuck do you mean? I don't understand. Fried the taste buds right off? Yeah, what, what the fuck? If I ever stop loving french fries? I know, right? I love all fries. <laughs> like, I, I have preferences. I like crinkle cuts too. Crinkle cuts are great. Appreciate a good fry. Waggle fries? They're not called waggle fries. You're so fucking furry that you're thinking of wagging your goddamn tail while talking about french fries for Christ's sake. You need to get off fur affinity, Cifferoni. This is absolutely unacceptable. You have a son, goddammit. What if he saw you like this? What would he say? Huh? Unfucking real. Only fries I actively dislike are sweet potato fries. I agree with you. I hate sweet potatoes too. I'm I'm racist against sweet potatoes. I had some dope ass lasagna from the spot near work where a middle aged woman with an Italian accent handed it to me and it was pretty good. Awesome. My son is also on for affinity. Oh my god. Fucking family furry meetups. Holy shit. Do you guys go out to the fucking park in your fursuits as a family? Hello, dear son. Let's go on a picnic. Put your fursuit on, Curtis. What the fuck are you talking about? That poor child. That poor child. Can you imagine? It's family fun for the whole family. I mean, that's the that's what fucking... Isn't that a little redundant? Uh... That's good. Well, as long as you're enjoying yourself. Thank you, Wes Gray Fox, for putting Gray Sketch in the cockshed. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Oh, God, you put her up there. I did. I did. I did it just for Tatami. I could sense that he, he, he had lust for the wizard rat in his heart. And so I put it up there as a permanent fixture. Hello, walking, talking robot. What's the weirdest thing you've ever done with your family? Have you gone on, like, furry picnics with your family? My God, you know me. I do. I do. I remember. I remember everything about you, Tatami, this second. How's your girlfriend? Have you, have you learned to become more emotionally receptive? Share a toothbrush? Staying together for the furry kids? Told my dad about CWC and found out he had heard about the Fanta thing? Awesome. Went to medieval times and ate turkey legs? I wish Tolo would ask about my furry. Proposing to her, that's awesome. Good shit. I'm happy for you. We share everything. Well, that's not a good thing. 
because we had a discussion a little while ago about a family who shared their socks. So that's not always the best thing to do, but that sounds good. Uh, thank you, baby. Every time I come home, there's a mess in the den. It's because Daisy? Both of them. What did they do this time? Uh, they tore up a bunch of paper and shit and pissed on the floor. Awesome. Cool. Epic. Epic. I wear her socks. Oh. Okay. Do you come in the socks? My dad had me and my brother pray to a couple of showgirls for a pick. Cool. Cool. My aunt's dog didn't like me laughing loudly. Is it a dog that hates joy? My socks aren't crusty enough. Me and my oldest brother years ago were at a local grocery store like Dollar General or some shit. We just started to shout and act like we were severely retarded just to embarrass me mom for a good while. Your poor mom. Your mom sounds like a saint. Is that why you started doing the pirate thing? Like you just, you were acting and then it just became who you were. Is that, is that what this is? Like it's been 15 years and you've just been stuck. Maybe they had nowhere to piss and tore the paper to have a place to take care of it. Many dogs are trained to do that. I don't know. Daisies just rambunctious sometimes. Can't just ask why someone's a pirate. You can. Grandma had a dog that would growl if anyone but her pet it, but it would never bite anyone. It was whatever kind of dog Lassie was supposed to be. I'm pretty sure Lassie was a uh, pug. Um, my son used to go up to random people and tug on their shirts and say he'd been abandoned. That's awesome. What did they say? Were you embarrassed? It was way bigger and not as stupid. It was probably a... It was probably a greater pug. <clears throat> ah, the most I ever got was a disapproving glance from some old woman at a Burger King. People who eat at Burger King are the worst sorts of people. I eat at Burger King twice a week. Um, it does something to you. Lassie is a rough collie. And I'm pretty sure it's a pug. I'm, I'm a dogographer. So I, I think I know what I'm talking about. Hello, Blueberry. What's up? I got lucky and never did anything weird with my family. I threw a tantrum once and mom poured a cup of water on my head to shock me out of it. All right, Nipple. Take it easy. The chicken fries. The chicken fries are good. Burger King makes your moist, moist dry up. What on God's green earth are you talking about? Hello, Yugi Birdo. The moist, moist. Wow. Cifferoni. I like you. You're funny. Chicken fries are the only thing they have. Only thing they have, I order it. If not, for them, Kang would be worthless for me. I like to get chicken fries and, like, fucking 50 double cheeseburgers. Told this to some people a bit ago, but I restated, did this in honor of me friends in the guild I was part of, and they pirates of the Caribbean online after a year or two. I tried to stop only to realize I conditioned myself. I still think you should you should take a U-turn and be, be like a doki doki desune ichiban mangi lady. Some asshole just almost ran me off the road. You better not be texting in my chat while driving, or I will fucking find you and run you off the road. Burger King is when you don't got money and you don't know what to eat, a.k.a. high school. Later, West Gray Fox. Take it easy. I just got home with Wendy's. I'm sorry. Ah. Towo Oni Chan. Would you give me Wilkies in my moist moist? No, but I think Logan2131 might. What's up, dude? How are you? Hello, Mew Kuki. Christ almighty, that was that was vile. Theodore Hold, I think, is next on the chopping block. I'm gonna I'm gonna execute him, I think. The internet doesn't let me have a single original idea. There are no original ideas. But once you realize that you can relax a little bit. Besides Whataburg, what other fast food place you like? I eat everything. Um, that's not true. I like Golden Chick and Chicken Express. 
I I also kind of like Canes now, but I'm weird. Like I I I think their fries are really good, but I think their chicken is worse than Chicken Express and Golden Chicks. Um, which nobody agrees with me on, but that's okay. It's all right. Can't enjoy anything except chicken nuggets from most fast food places. Thought my name was original, but someone also came with a shitty. Oh my god, dude! I don't even know what the fuck that means. Cane sauce is good. When's Goth IHOP going to open? Almost exactly the same chicken as Golden Chick. I, it's hard to describe. It's like a little, a little more. I don't know. I don't. I don't. I just don't like it as much. Chicken nuggets from Arby's are an offense against God. Anything from Arby's is an offense against God. We have someone in our Discord who has been talking about like getting railed in, in an Arby's restroom for like a week. Um. I don't know what that's about. Arby's is not a fast food place. I don't know what you would call it. I mean, like, like a... There's a new great picture in the Discord. Oh, good. I love great pictures. Let's see. Oh, that's a sick-ass little wizard rat. Neat. Here, let me, let me, let me show everybody. Um... I, I'm, I do have some constructive criticism on it, though. It doesn't have a Fudinari cock. And that's that's what this other one has that, that this one is lacking. Arby's is a dumpster that sells food. Uh, I like the curly fries and moss sticks from Arby's a lot. Might be hidden under the robes. I guess that's, that's a good point. Mmm. Ah, oh, now draw it giving birth. Yeah. I don't know their Twitch name. I can't name them here. I do. That's that's great Lord Nezareth. <clears throat> Excuse me. Arby's was my dad's favorite fast food. I think that might be why he watched Tolo stream that one time. Why? Because he was mad that I was talking shit on Arby's name. Hello, Springy. The best fries... Fried mozzarella I've had by far is actually at Olive Garden, I think. We went... There's, at Papado's, they have these fried mozzarella bites that are delicious. Hello, Tiny Elixir. What's up? Shroomjack is a fungal Lojack character that's drawn to look like a mushroom. I wish I was a Shrigma male. I didn't really like any of this alpha male, beta male, gamma male, sigma male thing, but Shrigma male is something I can... I can get behind. I really like the fried cheese bites from Chili's. I don't think I've had those. Male male. Sugma male. Shrig my male. Do you like the Shrigma musical? I love Infected Mushroom. Does that count? I've listened to Infected Mushroom since I was like fucking two years old or some crazy shit. I rescued a rat from my pool today. Awesome. Did it bite you? Or, like, did you did you use your hand? Did you use a net? Infected Mushroom is good. What the fuck is Infected Mushroom? Just YouTube it, dude. They make music. Awful idea for a Tolo and Torpal compilation pick. Huh. Okay. I listened to that like an hour ago. You got any particular album you like from there? From them? I don't know albums. I know songs. I My favorite is probably the... Um, the one that everybody fucking knows. The I'm playing the game one. Um, which I think that one's called I Wish, right? Uh, thank you, Yo-Yo. Or no, actually, no. Fuck you, Yo-Yo. That's a gift sub, so I can talk shit on you. You're a piece of shit. Oh, no. Okay. Becoming Insane is the one. Okay. Becoming Insane and I Wish. Uh, you know who else I like? I don't want to... I don't want to... Um. This is this is kind of showing my age a little bit now, but Pendulum is also something I listened to fucking constantly when I was a teenager. Still listen to him sometimes. What's going on, Father of Pearl? Showing your age a little? Yeah, I'm old. I'm an old man. Uh, I'm a dinosaur. Fried mac and cheese is good drunk food. It is. I used a net, but it looked like it was having fun swimming. Of course it is. Like, 
Have you seen that one video of the dude who's trying to feed a bunch of jack-off koi? And it, it looks like a koi is about to get the food, and then out of frame, a rat swims through at turbo speed and steals the fish food. They're surprisingly adept at swimming. It's pretty cool. Don't talk to me in your pirate speak. It's annoying. Yo, yo, come on, dog. I'm going to start talking in pirate speak to you. Ahoy, yo, yo. I hear ye be bussin' bussin'. I'm going to make you walk the plank. And I'm only going to I'm only going to talk like that to you. He knows me. It's fine. Stop. No, no, no. No. Mm -mm. No. I'm going to I'm not I don't even know how to do the pirate speak. Swab his poop deck. Ahoy me coming on the frickin' plank. Fred Perry would be ashamed. Who the fuck is Fred Perry? Time to hoist that mainsail. I wish someone would swab my poop deck. Jesus Christ. Hello, 13C. Captain Crow is a goddamn treasure of this stream. Do a collab with the pirate VTuber. I've never watched the pirate VTuber. Hello, Dream Ouija. Oh dear, don't we all? Finna dab yeet me mateys. Did they really just shit on the deck instead of shitting off the boat? I'm really excited for the stream to watch that five hour Bionic the Lore video. Honestly, that would be the funniest fucking thing I could possibly do. Is I say, hey everybody, we're gonna do a user submitted video stream. We're gonna watch everyone's videos. And the first video is the five hour long Bionic Lore video. And that's the only thing we watch. That would be fucking hysterical. But I don't actually want to watch a five hour long Bionicle lore video. Bionicle is cool, but I'm not going to fucking watch five hours of that shit. No. <laughs> Absolutely not, dude. Is this user submitted? Yeah. They submitted them in Discord and Otterbug screened them. So if there's anything bad in the video, ban Otterbug Twitch, not me. And if your video's not in there... It's, it's also Otter's fault. Um, I take no responsibility for anything. Afraid of the knowledge I am. Play the Bionicle game from like 20 years ago. Play the two times speed. It'll only be two and a half hours. No Bionicle lore. Did Otterbug scream my epic video? I don't know. Have you seen people on Twitter getting crazy with Bionicle parts to make sexy big titty Bionicles? I've seen a couple of those. The title wasn't just a bait. No, we're watching videos. We could stream the Bionicle games and I can give lore commentary. Oh my god, dude. I don't think I could take it. I, I would rather I would rather go through try not to have gay sex with Eevees again. Thick bunks are based. Please do it. Oh my god. That sounds incredible. A live Bionicle lore right along. This fucking guy and his Bionicles. I've unreleased Bionicle games that fans have recreated. Do you now? Interesting. T-Dog and Torpal Bionicle lore podcast. I don't know anything about Bionicles except they were cool and I built them. I don't know any of the lore. I don't know any of the, the ones that have big titties. So like I said, we're going to be watching videos tonight. And once again, I take no responsibility for any of this. If the videos suck, it's not my fault. They're literally user submitted. So you can't complain to me. Um, we're going to see how good your taste in videos is. And from what Otterbug says, a lot of you don't have very good taste at all. I haven't watched them, but she did. And she told me that a lot of you don't have a very, a very good sense of humor. Um, so we'll see. Which I, I am liking because I want you to submit dog shit cringe videos. That's my favorite type of video. I, the chances of me laughing at a video aren't usually very high. I like shit like Demix Time or Foam Adventure. Um, that's what I enjoy. So if you submit some of those, that's what I like. There's going to be some of that pop my pussy and I'm ready for it. 
It says here, most painfully awkward white dudes on TikTok. My video was the only good one. I own all the Bionicle games. I own 80 individual Bionicles. Bionicle pens. Bionicle pencil case. Bionicle backpack. Two Bionicle hats. And blue Bionicle Nikes and all of the movies. Jesus Christ, dude. How the fuck? I thank you, Rumbles, for putting on Taki in the cuck shed. I appreciate it. Hello, Pit Panther. Everyone who submitted to get shit on? Yeah, I'm gonna piss everybody off. I have more than that, dog. Show us, Torpal. Amass all of it. You must have the biggest Bionicle collection, right? Show it all off. I, su I remember begging my mom for an entire day to get me the second Bionicle movie. First video I put, you'll probably hate, but some are pretty normal. Sorry, I'm not cringe enough to hold you. No, I'm pretty sure. I have faith in your ability to be cringe, Ildaka. Um, a Bionicle Nikes are a real thing. Yeah, Torpal Duke here told a story on stream where he wore Bionicle Nikes to someone's fucking funeral. Which is one of the funniest fucking things I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> like, if I if I die, I hope people wear... Well, no one's going to go to my funeral. But if they do, I hope they wear Bionicle Nikes. What funny YouTube video that you swear to God, man, maybe I will have... I don't have any, but chat has a few. Um, Bionicles are just fucker pops with extra steps if you think really hard about it. I changed the shoe masks between the visitation and the funeral to match my outfit. I didn't real. Oh, no, that's low tier compared to the guys taking pics of his grandma's funeral with his Switch. I don't know if I can post it on Twitch because it, it, it involves a corpse. But I'm going to post my favorite funeral picture. Um, in Discord. Give me a second. Let me see if I can find it. It's one of the funniest fucking pictures I've ever seen. It sounds really fucked up when I'm saying it like that, huh? Okay. I have to find it. Just give me a moment. Don't be the kid in the Mario casket. Dude, where is this fucking picture? Describe it. It's CWC, whose birthday happened to take place on the date of his aunt's funeral. Here it is. And he had a birthday party with, like, Legos and shit on a table. And her corpse is just in the fucking background. It's the funniest fucking picture, dude. Okay, it's in Discord. It's it's hysterical. It, it is my one of the best images that's ever been made. Honestly. Oh, it is so good. I fucking love it. Ah, oh, man. That's what you gotta do, right? That's what you gotta do. People in my Discord are saying they hate it. What the fuck? Why? How could you? Uh, thank you, Julius T. Belmont, for the 17-month resub. I appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. It's terrifying and also very funny. It is. Just imagine singing Happy Birthday with a corpse in the room. Holy shit. Can someone link it here? I don't want to be in the Discord. No, I don't want to... I don't know if I'm allowed to show dead bodies on Twitch. It's not really gross. It's not a shock image or anything. You can barely see her. It's like the tip of her head, but I don't really want to risk it. What channel is it in? It's in the main one. Are her eyes open? Maybe. Some people die with their eyes open. It's weird that they didn't close them. If y'all aren't building Bionicles at my funeral, you're doing it wrong. I can say right now. Bungle Grungalow. CWC Met Corpse Husband. That would be... I don't know. I think they would at least get her out of frame. I don't understand how that's possible. Why did no one told him to stop? That's the kind of picture you expect to find in a serial killer documentary. Well, there's still there's still time. I'm here now. What the fuck was that picture? What Did you not like it, Vinny Vin? I thought it was a good picture. Do you have a problem with it? It's CWC having a birthday party on the same day and the same 
Um, what is the fucking word? I can't. I my I just blue screen the same the same venue as a funeral. Good God, that's the word I was looking for. Holy shit! <laughs> Fuck. Just fucking had a dumbass attack that, that, that lasted like 30 seconds. Jesus Christ, I drink too much Diet Coke. Holy fuck. It's a 10 out of 10 once in a lifetime picture. It's not even a family. No, it is. It is. It's his aunt. When is the secret Dark Elf stream? Once I get banned. Hello, Chicken Kai Cho. A funeral home just let this homie have a birthday party next to the corpse? Why not? Having seven emotes that look like fucking nothing when separated, but when combined to be Sonic Goatsy would be sick. That would be sick, but that would also be uh, one of the no fun allowed bannable offenses. Would you fuck a bunger? I mean, that one dude fucked a McChicken. Do you think the McChicken felt good? It looked like it felt good. So yeah, I guess so. If airlines can double book, why not funerals? Fuck me, Tobo Chan Wu. I don't like you saying that. For me, it's the McChicken. Dude, what? You know those awful fast food ads that streamers do that you have to watch on this godforsaken website? Think of it this way if we had an 18 or over an over section we could have ads with the twitch streamers fucking mcchickens that's what I, I would sell out like if i could do a commercial for for mcdonald's where i was fucking a mcchicken i would do it in a heartbeat um i would i would sell out the within an hour of that offer being made that would be fantastic not allowed come on just do it anyways for free, only if they have no mail. That would require you to buy a McChicken. K-pop member sauce. In the rat mask. What if you get mayonnaise and you don't don't talk about that? Oh, what's going on, Mika? Like the first episode of Black Mirror? Yeah. I like that show a lot. With your dick all in a McChicken covered in mayo pickles. Mayo and pickles all messy. Okay, this is getting a little too pornographic. I just want to fuck a McChicken. That's all I'm saying. Um, I wonder what the best sandwich would be. That's probably like the only reason people really get Arby's if you think about it, huh? It's starting to make sense. I'm figuring more and more out about the world every day. I always wondered how those fuckers stayed in business. I don't know anyone who eats at Arby's. I know like... Two and a half people, but the point still stands. Do you like the lettuce on the McChicken? I hate lettuce. I don't like lettuce at all. If I see lettuce on something, I pluck that shit out. What's going on, Potion Yeller? Would you fuck a Mudkip? No. I don't like lettuce? Yeah. Lettuce is fine. You're fine. Shut the fuck up. Did you see the pictures of my dog I tweeted? Yes. You got uh, jammies for your dog. You don't like the crunchy water? No. How do you know half a person? Next question. Literally just crunchy water? It's so weird to me that some of you can't grasp this idea. I didn't say I dislike lettuce because of the taste. I dislike it because they put it on shit that's otherwise juicy and I don't like crunchy fucking lettuce in an otherwise juicy delicious burger. It pisses me off. The only thing that's allowed to be crunchy on my burgers are pickles. Anything else can fuck off. What's the general plan for tonight? I'm going to watch YouTube videos that, that you all have submitted. Contrasts are good sometimes. I That's... that's up to personal opinion, and I disagree with you. You had fries on your burger? No. I think it's important to exercise some self-restraint. What the fuck, Mad Kate King? Jesus Christ. Why? There's like an influx of people making weird shit. Okay, look at this, everybody. Um, it's Torpal Duck. Isn't that excellent? What a handsome man. Could go for fried pickles right now. 
Mad Kate King is just sitting here thinking, Broke Rat Mountain. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds good. I'm going to make that. That's awesome. They would make a great gay couple. <laughs> What's going on, Bane Lux? You'd show my real face like that, dude. Come on. <laughs> Fuck off. Don't say that shit. Someone's going to report me and they're going to believe it. Uh, what's going on, Hustle Higa? Toe, was that your face? No, I don't look anywhere near that good. That's Torpal. Torpal's a handsome man. I'm not. I'm ugly as shit. I'm one, of, I'm one of those fucking creatures who goes onto Twitter or whatever the fuck and says, I'm such a fucking goblin. Uh, you know? I'm 50% hair. You don't know what I look like? That's a fair point. But I like what I see. This would make a good mouse pad. Why the fuck does Torpal look like a god? It's because he is. Look at him. God, he even has blue eyes. I hate that. Blue-eyed men freak me out. Torpal is the one in the front, right? Yeah. I want to breed a goblin short stack. Melon Fox, why the fuck would you say that? I can't believe you said ahoy yo yo bussin bussin to me. Yeah, I did. What are you going to do about it, pussy? I'm the anti-Tolo you are. You are. Torpal is a rat? He is. Hmm. Honest thoughts on Midna? I think Midna caused an entire generation of gamers to be attracted to midgets, which is great for me as a 5 foot 10 man. So I think Midna was a, a, a net benefit to society for me. Um, Midna's fucking gross. Is that like a Shrigma male? I guess so. Those gamers are male? Not all of them. You don't know that. 5 foot 10 equals midget? Yeah. Yeah, it's fucked. I'm basically like, I'm, I'm a fetus. Wonder if Torpal would consider donating semen to all... Oh, why the fuck would you say that, dude? Come on. Jesus. They knew what they were doing when they made Midna. They did. Did you cry when Midna broke to me? I didn't play it very long because I thought it was boring. I got bored within like three hours of playing Twilight Princess. I guess that makes me a fake gamer. Um, she's shorter than a midget and has proportions that made me worried about people who want to fuck that thing. About two separate emotes that look nothing, like nothing but are actually left and right nuts of a rat. <laughs> Stream title legit, no game for tonight? Yeah, we're watching YouTube videos. I got people to submit them in Discord and Autumn filtered them for, for TOS violations. And so we have, I don't even know how many. Um... I'm not going to bother counting them. I, I, I'm I'm stalling because the very first submission is Bloodborne Brain Sucker Kill. The first one I have to watch is Brain Sucker Kill. So I'm taking my sweet fucking time. Um, I do not want to watch that video. Not one bit. It'd be funny as fuck to see you play CDI Zeldas. Hope I didn't leave anything bad in there. She secretly left one video on to get you banned so you have more time for her. Let's go. Let's start already. All right, let me piss and we can start. Give me a sec. Oh. Leave to make another drink and I come back to fucking broke rat mountain. Why are you drinking, Cifferoni? Do my streams make you want to consume alcohol? Why did you get the chop? Because it was too sexual. Twitch Twitch said no more. And so we had to replace it. 
Uh, I did not remove it voluntarily. Give me a sec. Okay. I have to get my shit set up. I need to figure out how I'm going to do this. So give me just a sec. My salary man lifestyle makes me want to consume alcohol. We have T-Dog Rungle, though, which is better, in my opinion. Um, okay, I'm going to have to do desktop capture, which really makes me nervous. I'm always afraid I'm going to show my um, my big black anal acrobats collection or something, you know? Okay. We're probably going to have to get Torpal off of the screen here. But this is this is our setup we've got. What's going on, Sniper Knight? I'll post T-Dog Grungle when the video isn't funny. No, don't do that. We might see your henty bookmarks. Yeah, you never know, right? What if we just watch like this? Huh? Alright, see? We got the fucking Tolomeo R Bloodborne Brain Sucker kill. This is... God damn it, I fucking hate you, Ananas. Ananas, you were such a cunt. I hope your dad shows up to your wedding, you motherfucker. Piece of shit. Fuck you. Just watching videos today? Yes. This was from like 2015. I just uploaded everything. I upload. I spam uploaded like every like boss encounter and the. I'm not even gonna fucking explain. It. Let's just fuck it. Let me know how the volume is. Two minute blood sucker kill. I know, dude. I'm using Ludwig's Holy Blade. It's a bit hard to hear. Alright, let's max volume the brain sucker kill, man. Alright, we're gonna use this video as our test. Is it still too quiet? Can you center it on screen better? No. Absolutely not. Not even gonna full screen? Okay, let's full screen. Do you like it? <laughs> Do you like it? It's good, right? <laughs> Actually, this is kind of sick. Oh my god, I switched weapons. The plunge attack, baby! Look at how fucking good I am at this game. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He fucked it up, dude. He doesn't even know how to suck dick properly. I fucking hate this. That was a good mic. It was a $10 Logitech mic that was, like, broken. It was hanging by a cord. Total used to be so lively and happy. Yeah, you can hear it. You can hear my will to live in my voice. Hello, Sushi Click. What's up? So I'm so smart, I was like 22 years old. I'm almost 30. <laughs> oh, okay. uh, someone got brain sucker kill printed onto a mug. My my merchandise. How fucked is that? Like I I'm gonna have to live with this for the rest of my fucking life. Like I'm gonna be I'm gonna be dying in a hospital bed. I'm gonna be like the fucking machine's gonna be going. And some asshole, like, Apollyon's gonna fly over and just, like, sit down next to me with a tablet and put this video on. And... And this is going to be the last memory that goes through my head is the fucking brain sucker kill. They're never going to let me let it go. Like, look at this. This just shows that, like... This was less than a year before I was doing New Game Plus 6, level 4, no rolling, blocking, parrying. So if this guy and his brain sucker kill could do it, you can too. <laughs> What's going on, Quantum Zed? Fuck. Alright. Okay, this is how we're going to do it. Bigfoot hunting. I've seen this one. What a nightmare. Do you want to... I, I guess we'll watch it. I know what's in this. <laughs> this is pretty much um, a pheromone of a female grade ape, whether under a menstrual cycle. 
of female gorilla, female orang that are on their period. And <laughs> they really as well. So hopefully this will entice some more orange. Hello, you know, how did you get this? Actually, I got this from a guy. He, yeah. Too quiet? Okay. Sasquatch pheromone chips. As far as our genetics go, we're what? About 99% related to a chimpanzee or something like that. It's not too far off to say that we can't breed in a breed with them. But it has to His be dude hybrids wanted to in fuck order a for Big their so species to be able to thrive. Are What's wrong hit? with people in Minnesota? Scared? No. God, he's so creepy looking. Pops. <laughs> that dude is so fucking funny. How long is this? Fucking eight minutes. They're not going to give out their position. They know we're here. If there is a, a family group that's in here, maybe they're thinking like, hey, whoa, what's going on, you know? They're smart. Minnesota Bigfoot Research Team. They know we're here most of the time. Don't trust anyone and named Dylan ever. Keep on switching it up and switching it up. What we're doing All is we're, Dylan's want to fuck knocks. a Sam's Now that we're going back farther and deeper, we're going to do three knocks. It's like, kind of like a Morse cold, I guess you could say. Are you ready for this, Andrew? Should I be scared? It's nothing to be scared of. Oh, you hear that? I love this dude. Minnesota Bigfoot Research Team. You're probably wondering how I got here. It's been a crazy year, 2020, right? I was beginning to lose my mind. Was he trying so to I drove feed my camper van as far north as I could. Gym? That's awesome. I stumbled across a small town with a secret too big to hide. So I hit the streets to find stream? some answers and figure out what the hell is going on in Reamer, Minnesota. Imagine living in a town. I smashed a monster can that wasn't opened over my head and it didn't bust open right away, so I had to do it twice. And it hurt, <laughs> but I didn't care. My dad was born like on 9 11. Like his birthday is 9 11. My dad's pretty fucking scary. My name is Joshua Townley. I'm 14 years old. My favorite video game is Black Ops 2, Call of Duty, and my favorite rapper is YNW Melly. Yeah, my fucking favorite rapper is YNW Melly. All these pussies are hating, trying to knock me off my grind. I can't let them do it. I got murder on my mind. I like J. Cole. I what the fuck is wrong with these people? <laughs> Reamer, the home of Bigfoot. How do you guys feel about that? I've never seen him. I've walked through the woods. Oh, no, yeah, I'm getting I've banned. He's not that big of a deal. I'm just walking around trying to find some weed. What's going on, Leo Kira? Bigfoot is The first real. fucking video and I'm going to get banned. Bigfoot is not real. Bigfoot is not real. No. Why not? Last stream ever, it was, it was good. It's swamp, babe, but not necessarily Bigfoot. It's a mock, like mockery of just a small town making it into something to make money. I mean, we're on the border of a reservation and all of a sudden now we got Bigfoot. Cool. I mean, shit. I began to realize something wasn't right. Every person in this town had a rhyme or reason for why this thing wasn't real and why I wasn't a good enough journalist to get this job done. Loser! You suck! Boo. Get a real job. This town is better without you. But in the 11th hour, I met <laughs> I a like badass that motel owner a chick with seems the balls cool. to tell me the Dude, truth. Dude, I would like to live in this town. It seems like it would be fun. If they're saying they're non-believers, they haven't stepped out from their office or off their couch. You know, I've, I've had sightings, yeah. you know, I've seen three, three screams, two whistles and a knock. And then I whistled back and I got another whistle, then I got a wood knock and then a sneeze. I keep forgetting about the sneeze. Then there was a sneeze. God dang it. It's more intriguing it's than anything, boring. but it's frustrating I don't know, the same breath because this will be I can't seem to pin yeah. these Why things down. They're not stupid. Enough videos, we'll not do it again enemies. tomorrow. We're not the only bipedal intelligence here. Do you think every single person is lying or do you think they've seen something? They've seen something, brother. 
It's just the way it is. Every We're single person. We're trying to figure out movement on this thing. Bigfoot, the real Bigfoot, he was hairy I hope your circumcision gets better. Big. He must move fast because people see him in other states. I'm well, just out going out my deer stand. <laughs> I like that. Came up, looked all shrunk in and like, looked like he it's was It's just hungry, a singular like, Bigfoot, but he's just like mean? Sonic the Hedgehog, so you, you see him in all these like different that. places my all the time. My first experience with Bigfoot, I was 16 years of age back in 1976. Have you ever been on, in, a gar in a garbage dump with his rotten fish? <laughs> yes. That's what it smells like. We were chilling in the woods, you know, smoking on blunt and fucking hello. Just noise, bruh. From the woods and rustles and shit like that. You know what I mean? Just... Oh. That sounds like a donkey. Bigfoot are very sensitive souls. Bigfoot lives matter. <laughs> well, they have the riots and the looting. And, uh, since they were okay to have protests there, we thought, well, Holy we could have a protest shit. here too. <laughs> you have a shirt They're not there to be hunted. Bigfoot it's just supposed lives to be searched matter. for. What the fuck? <laughs> Dude, come <laughs> on. Sense. Uh, Abe Del Rio, also known as Elusive One in the Bigfoot community, is the founder and director of the Minnesota Bigfoot Research Team. That's who I am. I got chased by one back in 2001. So is there one Bigfoot or is there multiple big feet? Multiple big feet throughout the whole United States multiple. except for Hawaii. Why? Well, Hawaii is a volcanic island. It wasn't a part of Pangea when all the continents were together. How many big feet do you think are currently active in the continental United States? I would, I would say over 50,000. He was going to say a couple, and then he said 50,000. I like that. 50,000 big feet. Jesus Maybe Christ, feel can you more imagine? Maybe as the sun's setting to come a little more closer and approach us. Hopefully we'll get a young one coming. Who knows? He won Dude, he's not only a... Did he say he wanted a young Bigfoot? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. Is yeah. this dude a... Over 50,000. It knows these trails like the back of its hand. Maybe they'll feel more comfortable as the sun's setting to come a little more closer and approach us. Hopefully we'll get a young one coming. Who knows? So he's That's trying to lure young big feet with with her not. ape period blood. Map, map, map. This guy must have written for Fall Out the Frontier. Now, we were definitely being followed. <laughs> Whatever it was, it was big and it was just swaying back and forth. What we seen was something big and dark, and it was kind of doing an motion like this. Pretty likely we had a class A. What do you think it was? I think it was Bigfoot. You guys were right <laughs> behind us, and you saw Bigfoot, and we didn't. As soon as you guys got over, we looked back and gone. Are you disappointed that you? <laughs> are you disappointed yes, you didn't, you didn't yes. see Bigfoot? I am. I am. I, I mean, it is. It's, it's bittersweet, and that's the story of my life, the way it's been for the past twenty some years now. That's crazy. that's how that's old crazy. I am. Squatch on. Twenty seven fucking years. Good God Almighty! Can you fucking imagine dedicating and devoting twenty seven years of your life to getting like eight period blood and gallivanting around the woods looking for a young nubile Sasquatch? Holy fuck. What a nightmare. That was a journey? I, I'm ready to tap out already. Okay. Oh, I've seen this one. This is like Autumn's favorite video. You'll like this one. You want it, him, bitch? Is that who you really wanted? You sure about that? <laughs> there he is, bitch. <laughs> Dude, honestly, like, there he is. <laughs> there he is. I'm not a woman, but if some dude made a video like this towards me, I don't know, dude. Um, Albany CrossFit Strongman, the worst weightlifting video. Okay. Was that a wasp nest? Yeah. <laughs> The 
Is someone gonna get hurt? You got it. Do it again. You got it. This is this is awful. I hate this. I don't go to the gym, and even I can tell that their form is terrible. Oh, you got it. You got it. Right in the car. Nice fast hips. Take a drive. Oh my God, dude. Yep. Now, now do it. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, you. Oh, all right, all right, I'm gonna pause really quickly. You know, I just had a great idea. Do you want to hear it? I want to do a competition where we got. If we have Tolomeo Khan, we all have to do this, but we all have to have erections. So if we drop it, it hits the fucking boner on the way down. I think it could be really good. I can't wait for Tolomeo Khan. How are we going to guarantee God bonus? I'll post the wizard rat. Got it. Head, 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 head. Good. I like that noise. This is literally the entire video. Oh my god, dude. Sent this? Dusa. I don't know who Dusa is. Keep the stomach forward. Eight minutes of people per week. No, it's only four minutes. Don't worry. Thank you, Mad KK, for putting sushi in the cup shit. I appreciate it. I love your determination, you animal. Oh my god. Double filming. Double footage. That's gonna be 3D. Nice. Oh, you got that. Do it again. That poor dog. Oh, Scott, dude, you is that a three-legged dog? That was a tripod. You got it, yeah, 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 yeah. Drop low, Jess. Come on, Jess. Get under that bar. Low cows. Let that bar just rise above your head. <laughs> I like the sound Let it effect. Rise above your head. <laughs> rise, rise above your head. Too much. Just drop. This is up. awful. Split your head. <laughs> I hate every moment of this. Look at that. All right, you got to be aggressive now. Pop and drop, Jess. Where can I find a wizard rat G-string? That's not going to happen. Do you want me to be like cryotic and, and have like tea dog panties? Nice, Ellie. No. Come on. The worst thing I've ever seen. I'm sure we're going to see worse. Don't worry. Do you think any of these people will be at the Tokyo lower, Olympics? The three-legged dog might. T-Dog middle school gym uniform. Waiting for someone to snap their knees. Flip it, flip it. I don't think it's going to happen. Okay, whatever. Alright, this one looks good. This one looks good. Megan Massacre. Listen up, blood on the dance floor, haters with a Z. I already like this one. Hi, Alvaro. <laughs> um, I watch you like all the time, and I saw you making fun of those girls, um, for like in Asking Alexandria and stuff. And, um, I just wanted to tell you that you're an immature little brat. <laughs> 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 Like, uh, that is disgusting. Why would you make fun of us for, like, asking Alexandra and Bring Me the Horizon I and OTF and stuff? Like, they're so much better than you. Like, they make so much music, and they sing good. And they write lyrics good. I they write lyrics, lyrics good. be like Lil Wayne. Oh, 
We we might have found it. Also, if you remember when we were talking about a Neanderthal VTuber, I think we may have found our prime candidate. Me stream good. Me play video game good. Ugu. I've never seen this video again. before, Darby. I'm gonna tell them, and they're gonna come after you. And you know what they're gonna do? <laughs> you watching the stream you. is gonna be okay. a mistake. What I'm, the fuck? If Why? I do it, I'll do it myself because I'll do anything for them because I love them and I am their number one fan. <laughs> so <laughs> you disgust me, okay? I think she's trolling. <laughs> Alro. I think she's trolling. You're a pathetic little cunt. <laughs> she's got. <laughs> she's no, got to be trolling. There's no I'm way she's not taking I'm the hardcore, piss. And I'm bi, so I'm allowed to talk about girls' body parts. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what, okay? I don't think I have anything else to say to you. Um. Is that how it works? Just, you're never gonna lose your virginity. You already know that, though. You're just gonna die alone. Because no one likes people who like metal. Well, wow. not your type of metal. Your type of metal is all screaming and bullshit. I like good metal. Because, like, it's all hot guy singing. And that makes it good. You probably okay, like people with, like, honest. beards and, like, gross guitars that, like, you know, fucking play and... Ugh. You don't, you don't play guitar. Okay? You got someone else to play guitar. If you play guitar... You're not a musician, okay? <laughs> you're a talk. troll. This is a fucking troll. And... Mm, uh, I could go on. Because they're so amazing. But I'm not going to. Because I know. But you'll never understand. Because you're a pathetic little cunt. <laughs> Bye. And I don't love you. Anyone else who's watching this, though, I love you so much. Mwah. <laughs> <laughs> Sleep with Jesus. Rest in his own words. Well, I'm tempted. What the fuck is this recommendation? I would like to sleep with Jesus. Rest in eight hours of Christ's commands. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Don't open a fucking browser window. Okay. I think it's just church ASMR. Japanese man chases car while yelling sex at the top of his lungs. Age restricted. That's a fucking bummer. Um, do we want to watch this video? What a nasty little pooch. <laughs> Scroll up, please. Okay. My bad. I don't. I need to open the OBS window so I know what it looks like on your end. Give me a sec. Okay. What a nasty little dog. Thank you. No problem. I want more videos like that blood on the dance floor bullshit. We're only YouTube videos selected? I don't think so. Sif. Can Sif recognize herself? No, she's a dog. Was that Angel? Uh. Yeah. I completely forgot about blood on the dance floor until that video. What was the name of your girl? Her name was Angel. Dogs are summoning me, I must answer their call. I need more like if you play guitar, you're not a musician. Look at my gross fucking hands. Sif is so cute. Sif's pretty good. She's a pretty good yog. T-Dog man hands? My hands have gotten smaller since then, if you can believe it.
fluffy coconut girl? Like when she has blush on her cheeks, tea dog Yui hands? Yeah. Look at that fucking nose. Look at those cheeks! Confirmed they put soy in Whataburger? Of course they do. She's very precious. Tea dog effeminate hands. They got little lady hands. This video looks wrong, I swear that's her paw. She likes it when you rub her paw. She likes holding hands and having you rub the top of her paw. Those eyes just say poop somewhere, you'll never figure it out. Until no, she doesn't. It's been so long since she's gone inside. I can't even remember. Spinnies. She's a good girl. She is. She's a good little doggy. She disembowels all of her plush toys within like 30 seconds. It's a lot of fluff. Yeah. If you brush her, you get like a pound of it minimum every time. Because I see you'll never find the body. That's most dogs? No, you have no idea with Sid. Look at that face. That big heckin' chunker. I thought the BG in the Sif clip was a drum roll. Does she still have the piggy? Daisy broke one of her piggies. She still has two out of three of them. If you collect the fur, you'll have enough for another sip before long. That's one brushing. Okay. How to perfectly butter toast. This looks like it's going to be a fucking video. It's how to basic, so... <laughs> Every one of this dude's videos is like fucking the food up, right? <laughs> Me and your mom, Lamal. <laughs> 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 Oh my god. So funnier, funnier than this video at least. <laughs> Holy shit, come on. <laughs> what the fuck? Get on with it. Wow. Woman struck by lightning speaks. Oh, good. Let's see this one. A Boise, Idaho woman is considered a medical miracle. Laura Esterman was struck by lightning nearly a month ago, and she was considered officially dead. Thank you, Katz, for the Thankfully, CPR months, from her mom revived her heart, but she laid in a coma for two weeks, and then she defied all odds and woke up. I, 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 I should buy <laughs> <laughs> well, obviously, there was a problem with that tape. She doesn't really sound like that. She doesn't remember the episode. I, I wish the she did. Either. That would be funny. I'm so sorry. Laura's learning to walk again after the lightning burned her legs. And we'll have more on that story. And hopefully, get that tape fixed for you. You can have this soy food. Oh, okay. This is a Pyroman video. This is going to be good. Hello there. How about some soy food? No. Not yet. Sorry to bother you. I just wanted to say that you can have this soy food. What a shame. Oh, that's a nice puppy. Video redeemed.
Later, Kaleidio. Great Davies. place here. You've got ten seconds to have this soy food before I add you to the list of NSF casualties. Why is he trying to force feed me soy? Five seconds. Uh oh. Three. One. Make it last. I killed homeboy out by the tracks. By the way, I saw your daughter down the street. She didn't look so good. I mean, I like the dog. Okay, what the fuck was that? Oh, no. It's a clip. I have to take it off. I can't listen to my own voice. Come on. It's loud. He's a good dog. Calm down, dude. Calm down. All right, all right, all right. So yeah, that's that's Wiggles. Thank you, Mega Bagel, for the fifteen. He's very talkative. Sub. I appreciate it, dog. Wiggles crashed my game. <laughs> Total I trying to attract into? a Bigfoot. You know it. Russian exploding bottles part two by Chump Cump. Okay, I, I have faith in Chump Cump. Come on, oh my God! <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? I wish I was Russian. It reminds me of Stalker. My favorite videos in less than 10 seconds. Okay, we have Randy Flex. Oh no. Okay. I don't like this. Oh dude, holy shit, look at those tits. Sigma male right there. This is exceedingly uncomfortable. Lift your shirt up, pussy. I want to see your gut. Who the fuck sent this video? Incromancer? Right, well <laughs> I, I, like, I like the recommended one. Uh, thank you, Pessimistic Archer, for the resub. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, Genso. Us gamers, huh? Reuploaded. Avi. Seven fucking minutes. Is that a twelve cord? Sixteen, with a ten meg pipe. I need the faster response times for the newer online games. There's a lot of people after my high scores. Wait a second. Is Max Destructo your gaming handle too? Thank you, Alchemy. But it's, it's not resub. just Max Destructo. It's Max Destructo five seven four. Nope, just Max Destructo. You hold the high score in virtually every massively multiplayer online role-playing game. Impossible. You single-handedly killed the entire skank horde from Isle of Cardia's and Blood Fun 6. You're... It's awesome. So this is just a compilation of like dog shit video game sections from shows then, huh? I move left, he goes right. That's me. Oh. Solve a murder. One awesome kill at a time. Oh! What up? This is fucking terrible. 
Okay. Uh, this was what was found in the hard drive from the crime scene. It's Gears of War 3, and it is awesome. Stupid. Well, maybe if you didn't play sports so much as a teenager's played some video games, you'd be winning like me. Oh, right, yeah. Um, the hard drive that's in I this don't want to live anymore. was actually the one that was used in the final round of the tournament. But the game, Gears of War, was rigged. Gears of War, that, Gears of War, Gears of War, Gears of War. It's such a shitty advertisement. The computer coding found in the Vic's car is a step-by-step -step guide on how to hack the game. <laughs> now, I tried using some of the coding <laughs> okay, to that part play was a regular fucking funny. Gears of War game, and I got this. I have someone coming to perform CPR on my computer, and by the way, Antique Silk. My tech can fix anything. Oh, and he's even early. Uh, only because his friends are all hanging out at the arcade later. <gasps> it's working! You're my hero. If I'd lost the inventory, your mom would have quit. The files are all there. I just had to defrag your hard drive. Please, watch your language. We have company. Ned, Eli, Eli, Ned. Cool. You're the guy that hears ghosts. Yeah, what Delia's the kid. fuck is this? Thank ghosts. you, WXP, for the 17 month the resub. Yeah, I appreciate it. Any catch. ladies I'm want their first. hard drive defrag? Good job on me, <laughs> Oh, sick. Alt World 2. Is this version 5.0? Yeah, it still has some kinks, but if you overclock your rig, it kicks. This is giving me a headache. I took like three Wait, ibuprofens this before the stream. Me and my friends. Yeah. I'm online right now. Uh, that's my avatar. Avatar? What is that? Some sort of ancient weapon? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Uh, what I look like in the game. Uh, an animated Holy version. Shit. It could look like the actual game or, or be a complete fantasy. You can pick hair, skin color, clothes, and <laughs> anyone do anything. <laughs> that is why I keep a close eye. This video is fucking awesome. See? I changed my are. mind. You just went virtual. Yeah, but I would never wear my hair like that. Your avatar does. So instead of going to an actual place to play games, you, ooh, could you make me taller? Uh, there are games in here. Mostly it's a place where kids go to hang out in the world. Hey, and it's educational. I mean, you can meet people from around the world. Ned, yeah, show her. Oh. There it is. La Cita Eterna. Our suspect said he saw Venus here a couple hours ago. We need to find her and find out who's using her avatar. What does he want? Subsisto! That's Cesar. He's the, uh, landlord. This island is off limits. Why don't you ask him how many landings it'll cost to get in? Can I pay you? Admission is free, my friend. All you need to do is perform two tasks. That was a Morrowind sound effect. Which death is I heard it. To every other? I heard it. It's free, my friend. All you need is free, my friend. All you, you hear it? Free, my friend. All you need is free, my friend. All you need to do it's is perform It's the spell casting from Morrowind. First, the question. Which death is preferable to every other? The unexpected. Correct. I'm such Second a fucking task. loser. Take this teleport and follow I recognize me. that. Prepare for battle. You serious, Mac? He's got too much time on his hands. Yeah, well, this is a modded well, Morrowind mod. It find it, says, I hope so. We're not getting in. Right, and there goes our chances. I recognize that, Bulge. Oh, he's looking sexy. What the hell is going on? Is it? Wait, let's go back really quickly. Dude. Hold on, I want to show you something. Oh, come on. Lex would absolutely want to fuck this guy. I can hear her shrill voice right now trying to defend her wanting to procreate with this minotaur. Oh, dude, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, boss. Uh, with all due respect, you don't. I could take five of me. You think so? And you do. I guess. Want to see when people play RuneScape? <laughs> I remember I so. that. I remember the cashews of we chaos. Lose, we lose the only solid lead we have. I can do it. Thank you, Recon, for the 55 months. What's up, dude?
We're gonna have to do two streams of this bullshit to get through all of this, huh? Here we go. Get some of this. Say my name. This is fucking terrible. Oh. You dead. Uh... Oh, dude, that's sick. I like that. I'd play that game. That wasn't even hard. Why are you popping off like that, asshole? Were you aware of Plimpton's history with Watcher Fleet? Watcher Fleet? No. But he was always going on about Skyrim and Old Republic. You are talking <laughs> about dorky role-playing games, right? <laughs> you must be into those, huh? Until I took an arrow in the knee. Oh my fucking god, dude. I'm gonna have a brain aneurysm. Holy shit, that was fucking awful. Pokemon theme song is a dramatic monologue number 16. Oh, this looks this looks hinged. I wanna be the very best. Like no one ever was. To catch them is my real test. To train them? Is my cause. He's talking about a I will travel women. across the land searching far and wide. Teach Pokemon to understand the power that's inside Pokemon. I gotta catch them all. It's you and me. I know it's my destiny, Pokemon. Oh, you're my best friend. In a world we must. Defend Pokemon. What would the Pokemon look Gotta like if this was Ash Ketchum? A heart so true. Our courage will pull us through. You teach me, and I'll teach you. Lollies, cigarettes. Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all, Pokemon. Oh, okay. We can see clearly now. Okay, it's rats. Or might. We can see clearly now. Come on, let us go. Pulling on my shades to cover my eyes. I'm jumping in my ride. I'm heading out tonight. I'm solo. I'm on solo. I'm on solo. I'm on solo. What? DMCA? Yeah, probably. I'm already getting banned for something earlier, so that's okay. Why women should not say amen in church. Now, this is something I can get behind. Spirit. But the Bible says in 1 Timothy 2.11, let the woman learn in silence with all subjection. But I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to usurp authority over the actually, man. Hold on. Okay. So people are saying you can actually legit get DMCA'd for that. So give me a second. I'm going to go and delete the VOD for this really quickly. Just in case. I'll probably get another DMC hit for that. But maybe if I delete it quickly, maybe, maybe, maybe. Okay, so just give me a second and we'll 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 do it. We'll go back. Okay. Um, all right. Give me a sec. Just a second. Okay. We should be good now. Um, I back to the important thing. I want to hear what this man has to say. I feel like this was a good idea. Oh, I never thought it was a good and idea. And be in but silence. It would be funny. Now, flip over if you would to First Corinthians chapter fourteen. It says, "Let your women keep silence in the churches, for it is not permitted unto them to speak." 
but they are commanded to be under obedience as also saith the law. And if they will learn anything, let them ask their husbands at home, for it is a shame for a woman, for women to speak in the church. Now, it says in 1 Timothy 2.11, let the woman learn in silence with all subjection. So therefore, obviously, before the service, before the, the congregation begins the service, there's chatting and talking going on. That's perfectly legitimate. And then when we all sing praises to God, of course, the ladies should also lift up their voices and sing praises unto God. But wait a minute. When it's learning time, <laughs> it's silence time. See what I mean? <laughs> so what it's saying is that they are to learn oh in silence. God. And that's why it talks about Dude. in 1 Corinthians 14, 35, also what we just looked at. It says, if they will learn anything. It says, when the learning is going on, they are not permitted to speak. When the learning is happening, they are to be inside. When the preaching of God's word is taking place, it, first of all, it's not for a woman to be doing the preaching. And second of all, it's okay. not for women to be speaking. Even, by, <laughs> them, even if they were to have a question, oh, they're they not to ask that question in the church, number one. <laughs> And number two, even if they want to ask that question to their husband, they should wait until they get home. You know, they should not in the service be talking. And by the way, this is why I don't believe that women should say amen during the preaching either. They should Simply say amen. because Which amen, and uh, I talked about this in the Spanish class this morning, what amen actually means. It means truly or verily. In fact, when you read in your Bible... Uh, where it says, verily, verily, I say unto you. That's a pretty common statement in the Bible. Mm -hmm. Basically, that's from the word amen. If you read that in a Greek New Testament, it's like, amen, amen, I say unto you. But that would sound kind of weird in English if we said it that way. But just a lot of people don't understand what the word amen means. But amen basically means that's true. True. So when I'm preaching and I say something that you agree with, that you believe in, and you say amen, you're saying that's right. That's true. That's the truth. Now, here's the thing. When, when the preaching is going on, women should not express their opinion about the sermon. Even if it's a positive <laughs> opinion. And, of course, the heart is in the right place. Holy now, shit. I did one time. I was preaching one time, and a woman actually disagreed with me. <laughs> the audacity. You know, I, I said something, and she said I was wrong. You know, and I, I kind of, you know, blew up a little bit. But anyway. Yeah, I bet uh, you did. But, you know, a, a lot, there could be times when a woman is just agreeing. And, and you know what? The heart's in the right place, of course. But in reality, if we're going to be true to Scripture, this dude has then absolutely basically we would say, okay, when it's time for learning, that's a time for women to keep silence. There's no that's doubt. That's a time to learn. And There's no fucking doubt in my mind that guy has hit a woman before. What a piece of shit. You need need me. 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 Fetus energy, it really, it really does have that, huh? To more seven, everybody. They are actually, oh my fucking god, what the fuck is this? No, I know what this is, Autumn is saying this. Okay, Ildaka posted this. He said that he wasn't going to submit cringe videos. Ildaka, we have to have a talk. the one who picked this shit. I'm letting people show me videos. Oh my god. Don't leave like that. 
that did. I do like the orange man. The orange man was good. I'll give you that. I think we got the gist. No. Hello, Beepus. You know, I actually think this video was a prequel. What this guy was was saying makes sense now. He probably listened to that and then went on to make this sermon. I think that makes a lot of sense. What's going on, Akut20? I just arrived and think I want to leave. All right, bye. Sniffer.avi. What the fuck I am is a this? sniffer. Nobody's home. Let's break out. Sent me noodles home videos. Oh, this is good. Oh, thank you, Naxus, for donating a hundred fucking dollars. Hope you're doing this well. I'm man. not, but way. thank you. Uh, it's very generous of you. I appreciate it. You might be the only person on God's green earth who can listen to the Spooky Wookie Pumpkin song and say, "Yeah, I'm gonna donate a hundred. Thank you. What the looks, fuck? It looks really good on you. I know. <laughs> His face? He can't help it. He can't help it. I just got here. I regret everything. I know. I had someone just saying how far I've fallen. I have a feeling the, the people who say that shit don't even watch like 99% of my other streams and just come in here during this to say stupid shit. I've been playing video games all week. They don't watch that. Okay. Oh this is 100% on brand. I don't have a brand. So he's on. So, so sweet. Oh my god, this is fucking so terrible. Sweet. How long is oh boy. this? What the hell? Is that my shirt? That is not what I would say if someone. Like, I understand that it's like a shitty stage video. But if someone was in there walking through my house, I would not say. I would not say anything like that. Current Tolo sucks. I know, you've been posting about it in Discord. Uh, this is why women hate men. Run boy. Yeah, my first, my first question would probably not be what the stranger in my home is doing with my shirt. Okay. Fanboy fishing episode one. What would you say? I'd probably try to attack them because they were a stranger in my house. Fishing episode one. In this series, uh, I'm just gonna go uh, fish while I uh, dress like some gay shit. So, um, there are some people in Get Seas over there that are staring the crap out of me. So, right now, the light is flooded. Um, nice content, Tolo. I know, thank you. See, there's another one. There's another one. Like I've been streaming video game. games all week. You it's weren't here for that. Uh, now you're bitching. An hour ago or so. Ooh, see that? There's a largey right there. A largey. Can you scroll up a That's bit? A nice size one. Okay. I don't know if you guys can see that on the camera. I just got my little ultralight reel set up with one of my little panfish lures. It's only got. I thought you said five minutes max. Minutes. They never listen to the rules. Um, Hopefully we can be on the bigger ones. Sunfish? There are sunfish that aren't the ocean they're sunfish. They're just not being very responsive. I think it's just because it just rained. Uh, I had a few smaller perches chasing my bait. But, um, I think I'm gonna move a little downstream. Take your hand away down. from your crotch, you fucking freak. Somewhere else I can maybe try. You know, here's a little known fact about traps and fun boys. This is fucking stupid. Some of us are really Who fucking posted this? Melon Fox, what the fuck is wrong with you? 
Okay, barehanded deer catch. No, it wasn't a rule. It's it's no more than ten, but preferably under five. The shortest videos are always the funniest. Almost every single fucking time. Right, Tricky. Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to catch one of the most elusive Australian animals. The red deer. Now, this guy here, he has all the senses about him, right? He's got better senses than you do. He has a better sense Not true. of sight. This guy here, right? He'll see something in the distance, where it be 80, 90 meters. Bang! He'll just pick out and that. Boom! He'll just take off. Funny thing about deers is they use all their senses to their advantage. Their hearing acts like radars, the way they just turn. Listen, listen, listen. Any sort of stick snap, particularly here in the Lantana. A deer hears something like this. Bang, he's taken off. See you later. These guys here can reach 50 kilometers an hour in one hit. The funny thing about a deer is its best sense is my weakness. That's his sense of smell. He can smell. Castle, we found a man for you. Good news. Away. So the funny thing. Catching What's these going on, Blue Moon? You need to be able to mimic your environment as best as you can. First thing that I like to do is try and smell like the environment as much as you can. Lantana, it's got a very pungent smell. It'll Hello, take any sort of smell that you have. So just rubbing it all over your sweat glands, all over your face. You want to try and smell as much as the surroundings as you possibly can. Now, the funny thing about deer, oh, there we go. Smelling nice now. Woo! Now the funny thing about deer is, they're quite periodic animals, and trying to capture one of these animals is a bit like understanding exactly where his movements are going to be. Funny thing about deers, and what I know from my knowledge and experience, is often in wallows are the easiest place to try and capture these deers, and that's exactly how I'm trying to get one today. Use all the weaknesses that I can against him, camouflage the natural on tomato is the fruit. and boom. Be able to get one. We've got uh, a mixed bag the trails so far. which have been made by deers to navigate my movements for the thick scrub undergrowth. Keeping as quiet as possible and using the surrounding cover, I can then start to track down their movements this whilst being unnoticed. I'm keeping a sharp eyesight out for fresh scats, which I can use as an indicator of the time elapsed from when he first moved from the area. Generally what I'll look at is the colour and moisture of the scat content, as this is often the best indicator of when he was last there. Other we important have deers, indicators I'm not disputing are the that. scratch markings left in trees as a result of the deer's antlers. The tree Hello, markings Shane, are a result up? of the deer's attempt to scent the tree with his hormonal glands, located just under his eyes. This way he can inform other males of his territory and females of his presence. The obvious signs of fresh hoof markings can help me build a better understanding of the rest areas used for drinking and further lead me to my destination of finding their wallowing pool. The advantage of trekking through water has the benefit of be reducing of any noise like which may alert them of my presence. Party city antlers. I can't wait. Having finally found a wallowing pool, I place some native plant in my mouth to cover my breath, a scent in which a deer can pick up from at least 20 meters away. The process of now camouflaging myself with the wallow begins, and long and strenuous time to wait for an unexpected deer is only now a matter of time. How... Uh, how many of you think he's going to actually catch a deer? I'm not going to read chat because someone's going to spoil it, but I'm just curious how many of you who haven't seen this think he's actually going to catch a fucking deer in this video. Having heard deer movements for the fixed scrub behind me, the five hour wait has almost come to an end, and my adrenaline is absolutely building. <laughs> that was. That reminded me of Ice Poseidon whenever he saw a woman. Holy shit! This also reminds me of Ice Poseidon. Hey, relax! With relax. a woman. Feral deers! Feral Thank deers you, in Safe Australia! Walk and talk and robot in the a consistent cockpit. problem. And this guy here, he's just a destructor. These guys here are like nature's excavators. Just the way that they move. Settle. Wow, Settle that's fucking me. impressive. Settle with me. Okay, relax, mate. Relax. It's always key with these animals. You just gotta hold that center point of gravity down to the ground. 
Letting him is breathe. he trying to get it to suck his dick? What the fuck energy, is this? You drop your weight. Now this animal here he has just as much power as a horse. So it'll yeah, these things can kill you. I'm back, look at him. He's not happy at all. You're right, mate. Deer is scary. It's always key that you don't move him much. As soon as you get him into a comfortable hole, these things can be maybe relax. not this one, but some deer can beat rams and headbutting matches. Just kind of calm him down, relax, relax, mate. Settle down. You're okay. Now this is all about this is all about patience and persistence. Is it a dog in a suit? Animals. These animals aren't ununderstood. People hunt these. Settle, settle. Ah, come on here. Hey! Hey! Get over here! Okay. Drop your knee. Drop your knee down. Again. Okay, settle. Okay. Okay, mate. Suggested bare-handed animal catches. Oh, okay. What the fuck? This is all right. All right. It, it the fun is over. We're doing short little videos. The frustration of a battery oh. running out of a camera. Is I don't care. Okay. What is this? Thirteen minutes? What the fuck is this? Watch it? Do you want me to watch thirteen minutes of this shit, chat? Nerd shit, but cool? I don't want to watch this shit. I don't know anything about Warhammer. I believe it's good, but I, I, it's, this is this is not my forte. I'm just gonna if we watch this video, I'm gonna have nothing to say for 13 fucking minutes. Is that why you uploaded this? You want me to stop talking? I can stop talking, and we can watch actual good videos. Oh, this one looks good. The, this music from Oblivion Press. You're on camera, say something. Last night, and night before, there was three women walking down the street that way. I saw them. I said, hey, you three women, why are y'all walking down the street that way? There's nothing down there. And they flew away. I saw them. They flew crazy. away? Okay. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I like that guy. <laughs> hey, thank you for the forty dollar donation. I appreciate it, but I'm not. I'm, you can't bribe me. I'm not going to watch it, even if you give me forty dollars. I can give you the forty back, though. But I'm not. I'm not going to watch a, a Warhammer video that nobody wants to watch for forty dollars. I get that you like Warhammer. And I understand that. And I'm sorry, but I think the majority of us. It's. It's like. You know what it would be like. All right, check this shit out. Check this shit out. Give me a second here. It would be like me just doing fucking uh, explaining Legends of Eidolon to you for 20 minutes. Do you want that? No, nobody wants it. I would suck dick for $10. Uh, I can give you the money back. You know what? In fact, let me do that. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Because I'm not... I'd listen to that. Well, well, you're a stronger man than I. Give me just a moment. Okay, I don't, I don't take bribes. If you give me money to watch something, I probably won't watch it off of principle. Give the money to me. Yeah, Distracted Algae will watch it for $40. Um, okay. Hold on. Give me a second. And thank you, Surdy, for the resub. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Each video costs $40. Totally yes. No, 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 no. How do I fucking do this? Okay, give me a second. Broke Rat Mountain. 
Give me 80 and I'll watch it twice. 10 minutes max. Yeah, it broke the rules too. I'd watch it for a dollar. Give me money. I'm really not trying to sound ungrateful. What a pog champ moment. Yeah. How, how the fuck do people say your name wrong? That doesn't make any fucking sense. Algae? Well, maybe they're just making fun of you. What's going on, shrapnel? More of my tooth fell off. My dentist tells me there's nothing wrong, but I feel like I'm literally falling apart. Maybe it's time to get a second opinion. Each video is 1,000 pine cones. Okay. Okay, I refunded you, Nurgle. Um, all right. Give me a second. Let me get this back up. Okay. Where can I send you videos in my Discord? But I have a fucking huge list of shit to get through right now. You can still do it if you want. I'll probably watch it to watch more tomorrow because I don't think I'm going to get through all of them today. Um, you don't have to give me anything. Just it has to not violate terms of service. So like no gore, no like explicit shit etc right ah, ah. we know we're under attack we know it we're breaking the conditioning ah. <coughs> we're coming for you globalist <coughs> we're coming for you we know what you're doing <coughs> sorry i just get fired up when i think of what they're doing to us and how i want to resist them and how easy they are to defeat. <sighs> I feel like it's less funny than an Al just regular, a a like a regular clip of Alex Jones. That was a marked uh, degradation. Tola a Jones fan? No, it's just the anime. He's funnier than the anime shit. We're breaking the conditioning. God damn it. These globalists need to stop shoving their fist up my ass. Like, the way... I can't do his voice very well, but the way he talks is just... It's unique. Any any fucking dog shit Twitch streamer can do the... Ducky, ducky, itchy, bad! You know? Um... I'm just... I'm racist against anime shit, I guess. Newsreader cannot stop laughing at model falling over. Playback on other websites has been disabled. How to draw Goku SSJ4. How long is this? A minute? Hi, I'm Bill Conley, your cartoonist, artist extraordinaire, with uh, less than three minutes to draw Goku Super Saiyan 4. And uh, this guy looks like, with this getup on, if you ever saw the Mummers Day Parade in Philadelphia, the guys that go around with the, uh, they got the huge hair coming out. That's all it is. It's like, he's got that super... Feathers coming out for hair. Mardi Gras Goku. Used to go to Fantastic Sam's or, or something there, but uh, got the collar coming down. Just real, uh, real fancy coming down here. Goku is ready for action, going out on the weekends. <laughs> That's Feathers. what Goku does. Feathers there, but you could just spend. Wow. Probably spend almost an hour. Just making his hair. This will give you a basic. It's all concentric. All comes from there. Any any strand of hair that he has, it pretty much all all ends up. So it all comes and ends up right on his face there. Holy shit, dude! He does look like a pineapple, Anderson. There he is, ready to go out to dinner. <laughs> <laughs> you look, uh, being out to dinner, you look at the next table and. Uh, Alright, right, that, that made the fucking video Goku, worth it. Super Saiyan 4, and I am Bill <laughs> Conley, your cartoonist and artist extraordinaire. There's your basic layout, and thanks for joining me. See you next time. Excellent. Okay. Oh, no. Who fucking submitted? Oh, I... F Aren't you the new girl? <laughs> well, I thought so. Well, I've never seen you before. Konnichiwa. I'm David Kuhn. It's so nice to finally meet you. You look just like my waifu. <laughs> Anyways, I'm so sorry about the jerks in class. They're all baka and they only want one thing. Not me. 
I just like to watch my favorite anime, Jujutsu Kaisen, and read manga. Odaka, is this you? I think you're really kawaii desune. He, 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 he. I'm sorry. I'm just nervous, okay? It's just, well, it's just, I just want to know if I can suckle your niplets, okay? <laughs> well, what do you say? Uh? Maybe this is satire? Maybe. Shortest video on YouTube. Oh, thank God. That was a good one. Thank you, Loy. How to trick a monkey? I'm not falling for that one. What kind of idiot would click on this? <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> That said by Yoki, maybe. 3D Lion Ancient Rome commercial by Scoob. Hey, you might be okay. This lion only eats good food. <laughs> <laughs> Mayflower Buffet. Yes, <laughs> it really awesome. is that good. good At the corner of 3rd and Stinks, it's great. My ears, oh, was it loud? I'm sorry. The videos have like uh, very, very like uh, varying sound levels. That was awesome. We need more commercials like that. But if Twitch ads were like that, I would, I would disable my ad blocker. Maybe. Okay, Roy Lynn. It's a nice cat. The Meowyons are my favorite, personally. What a cute little guy. Okay. Intermission time. I think I need a break. I'm gonna have a fucking aneurysm from watching all of these goddamn videos. <laughs> I'm fucking... I'm, I'm... I'm glad that we got something to wash away the flavor of all of the weird anime bullshit, though. It was a nice palate cleanser. It was. I think I need to see that video again. Okay. I'm actually going to go to the bathroom really quickly. I'll be right back. All right, <clears throat> I'm back. Okay, what's the next one? Junior Christian Science Bible Lesson Show. This seems like it's up my alley. I love Christmas. I love Christmas. I love That's loud. I love Christmas. It's my 
I fucking hate Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> okay. cut off for submissions? No, but I don't know if I'm gonna do another one. Holy shit, I wasn't born for this. Me neither. You know, we all want to remember the goodness Hello, that ghost Christ to of Allegacia. Without that gift, we would not be saved. And you see, so we should all realize the meaning as you drink your eggnog, as you open your gifts, as you eat that turkey dinner, as you go from place Wait, to turkey place. dinner for remember Christmas? Remember the reason for the season, and Chip will tell us why. Yeah, you should always be grateful for Christmas because it's the birth of Christ Jesus. That's the real meaning of Christmas. Yes, indeed. And so as you have this in your heart, and as Do you, you not? No, I don't have Christmas start, dinner. Let us have one more frame of the I Love Christmas. All right. I love Christmas. This is fucking terrible. <laughs> I disliked Christmas before watching this, and now I, I dislike it even more. Wish I was this talented. I'm stealing this one. This is on par with the Tolomeo stream? God damn. <laughs> okay. You, you ready to go on to the next All one? All right, we saved the show. Yeah, this is the one where I get to sing. You can't <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, no background. All music. right, then. What? I will disappear. Well, I need a ride home. I'm on my bus pass now. I'll wait. <laughs> Uh, Is it show? going right into the next show? Or we're going to kind of change or anything? Oh, he's Make not it look a different? Is it over? It's not even over. Hmm. Okay. Getting home from the club at 5 a.m. I hate these fucking penguins. <laughs> Hmm. I'm guessing he probably wasn't actually getting home from the club. Because that would be really irresponsible. That looked like a really young penguin. He was like half the size of his parents. 14 tops. Okay. Oh, this is fucked up, dude. I hate this video. <laughs> this is, dude, this is how I feel when I stream. I'm the seal, and chat's the fucking cat. This is, li this is hashtag literally me. <laughs> Holy shit. What's this? Oh, God. That dude's face. I, I like that one. See, the best videos are always the short ones. Every fucking time. Awesome. Shame about the DMCA, right?
Dude, this is gonna be Twitch. Me and Twitch. I'm the seal. <laughs> no, it's okay. It's okay, Autumn. There's a lot of videos to screen and you're doing it yourself. Hire me, I'll watch garbage for hours. I'm doing that every day with Tolo. And you guys wonder why I don't stream very often. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's a mystery. Cats are so weird. Oh no. The fuck is this? I hate goblins. You were dumb. You were sad. Your brain run by goblin. <laughs> you were dumb. You were sad. Your brain run by goblin. I like this you one. You were dumb. You were sad. Your brain run by goblin. You were dumb. You were sad. Your brain run by goblin it should have stopped after the third one now it's just getting you were it's dumb. getting ridiculous you were sad your brain run by goblin you were dumb you were sad read the title your brain run by goblin no you, you think i can read dumb. you were sad your brain run by goblin <laughs> right you were dumb you were sad. Your brain run by goblin. You were dumb. You were sad. Your brain run by goblin. See? It wasn't infinite. Pretentious community college student. Oh, good. Now for a very special segment, our poet spotlight. For this month's poet spotlight, Storm interviews freshman Jacob Clayman. Check it out. Okay. For the month of February, we have our new poet spotlight. And for this month, we have oh, chosen God. a new student who Quiet. calls himself All right, my bad. His name is almost as much of a mystery as the things he carries around in his pocket. From his Shakespearean dialogue to his plaid jacket, this kid well, is probably okay. one of the biggest characters you will meet on campus. Let's get some details from him and some of his friends. Probably the most, the thing I like the most about Claimer is that he's not afraid to show his unabashed oddities thing that's, that make Claimer what Claimer, who Claimer is. For instance, his jacket that he wears all the time. I'd like to call it the coat of many pockets because it has so many pockets and each one of them is filled with just the randomest crap you could find. Like he has a bag of metal wrapped in the Norwegian flag. That's, I like this. This is my element. That? This is fucking horrible. I can imagine Claimer doing. He carries a rubber chicken in his pocket, tarot cards, <laughs> scrap of metal. I always feel safe walking with him in Uptown. <laughs> so I'm here with new freshman, um, Claimer, and you're in the play, right? How, how's that going? <laughs> well, it's, it's going chillfully thus far. I'm not, chillfully? Uh, Did he say so chillfully? Chill but, uh, I'm Holy fuck, it. dude. What's your role in the play? I play Elvis. Indeed. Tell us about that character. You know what? This guy is based. It's Elvis Presley, the uh, the famous 50s, 60s, and 70s. Um, I don't right, know anything so about Elvis, but I bet the, the, he, the, I bet the singer, that's not right. That sort of thing. Now, Claimer, you're famous for your unique way of talking. We were just wondering how you developed this eloquent way of speaking. Oh my! Oh my! Well, <laughs> I'm not entirely sure, actually. It just sort of happened, and I enjoyed it, and I just sort of stuck with it. This dude would be a great streamer. All right, so I, we spoke to some of your friends, and they this spoke a like lot the about some of the things you This is like the kind of guy you would see streaming Genshin Impact. Would you be willing to show us some of those things? Well, since you asked so nicely, let's do it. Perfect. All, we have my metal pocket, which is tied up in a Norwegian flag. Because I felt like it. Um, we have oh, all sorts of different things here. First off, we have the thing that breaks the rule, a rock. This is a piece of an airplane. Oh, 
back would be just fine. This is a piece of a pocket watch. Pocket watch? Indeed. This is a piece of a gate. A gate. Well, hello, a BK. Okay. Um, peace sign. Peace sign. Indeed. Round thing. So you carry all these things around in your pocket? Yeah. Other round thing. Do they ever come in handy? Usually not. If, if, if it comes in handy, it, um, it goes in my other pockets. Oh, yeah. My regular pockets. These are just, these are just, I enjoy them for the novelty of it, don't you know? Oh my now, you God. had a situation where you actually got um, stopped shit. by the police, and they saw some of the things in your pocket. What did they say? Well, um... I like the voice crack, first off, every other word. They weren't going to search me, but my metal pocket clanked against the uh, the car door, so they asked me to empty out all of my pockets. And um, one thing I carry around is uh, a deck of tarot cards and some other things, I guess, that are strange. So while they were... While they were making the report, uh, this was a verbatim quote. Hello, you got an 18 year old Caucasian male, driver's license number, my driver's license number. He's some sort of witch doctor. Life regrets by 100 plus year olds. You know for a fact one of those is going to be watching that fucking video. That's about the perfect thing you could, like, the, the best thumbnail imaginable. Granted, the only two people in my chat who are 100 are, are Papa Dap and Misa Coco, but, you know, what are you going to do? Feeling like 100 bucks. I don't know how you're What's going on, Siyoku Kumo? Feeling like 100 bucks. We're watching YouTube videos. Hey, did you fuck my sister? <laughs> Did you fuck my sister? Um, I want you to move out. <laughs> I like that. Oh. Excellent. Okay. What is this? This looks like it's going to be an actual video. A loop, coil, or section of loose line can injure or kill if the line suddenly tightens. These hazards are commonly known as bites. People working near bites need to watch feet and hand placement. Never stand in the bite of a line. Allow a body part to be caught in the bite or stand near a line that's coming under tension. That looks like it kind of hurts. Pinch points are created where lines meet fixed objects or other lines under tension. The extreme force of a taut line over a metal fitting can catch and crush fingers and hands, toes and feet. Be especially aware of loose gloves or clothing which can be caught at a pinch point. Snapback is potentially the most deadly of all line handling hazards. A worn line, the wrong line, or a line under too much tension can part, snap back and recoil, striking anything in its path with tremendous force. Always avoid the snapback zone, the likely path of a parted line. A best practice Hello, cynical, is dude. to paint the snapback zones on the deck plating as a reminder. Snapped lines, which are wrapped around a lead under tension, can be even more deadly, since they can swing around the lead in a larger arc, increasing the snapback zone. And snapped lines, traveling at the velocity of rifle shots, can also bounce and ricochet off solid surfaces, killing on the rebound, too. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Dude, fuck off. Can we go back to the, 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 the snap zone? Must be really, really good at pleasing women. I'm envious. Dominic Schmidt dancing in his cheerleading uniform. Who the fuck, Adam? 
Get in the cheerleader uniform, fucking nerd. How I'm gonna embarrass you, you fucking nerd. Gosh, this is so humiliating. <laughs> now do a cheer for me, you fucking nerd. He says fucking it. nerd, and the way he enunciates the end makes me... Like, I was so worried for a second. <laughs> like, I, I was like, oh, no, 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 dude. Um, I have a question. Does anyone know how to actually use these things? Because I, I seriously have no idea. Oh. Oh. <sighs> These guys suck. My third highest note. Torpal's a mad lad. That smack sounded painful. That seems like something Torpal Duck would do in his free time, right? Holy fuck. This dude can communicate with dolphins and shit. Oh, cool. He's so cute. It's so loud. These things can break your fucking tank if you have them in aquariums by doing that. Damn, he punched that fucking thing. Punching that hard underwater too? Yeah. XX Squidward XX. There's like a 50% chance of there being bad words in this video. It's Squidward, so I'm not sure. This one's okay? Oh, okay. I feel like chat's on a vendetta against me tonight, so we'll see. It's like a, it's a conspiracy to get me banned. I turned it down. What the hell? That's real? Holy shit. Wow. <laughs> I love Squidward's videos. I'm gonna go take a dance. BRB bath. I've gotta see this later. <laughs> Why the fuck is that Yoshi story music? Okay. What is this?
What the fuck is that about? Procreation full length. Um. As gamers, you are oh, smarter, no. sharper, and just generally better humans. <laughs> now, the world needs you. Here at the Peak Humanity Procreation Facility, experienced gamers from around the globe are donating their superior DNA to ensure a better future for mankind. I'm donating. I'm donating. Our world needs my eggs. <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think so, dude. God, she said it with such a serious face, too. She had conviction. Transcend humanity through gaming. Thank you, North Korea. I appreciate it. The world needs my ex, too. I'm, I'm sure it does. Wow, that was fucking miserable. Uh oh. Wow, it sure is great being home after a long day of work. I'm gonna change it to something more comfortable. These clothes feel like they are really new skin. So hi. These videos are so fucking stupid. Oh, what's going on, Aetherius? I know this guy's channel. He makes a lot of ROM hacks. What's going on, Gaben? How are you? Is this it? Is it just showcasing I'm doing the dab animation? Why is Yoshi making that noise? Peach! Everybody knows Yoshi's supposed to sound more like... Pretty well, that's good. Go. Epic. I, I still, I still don't. Oh, God. Okay, okay. How many, how many fucking characters? It, uh, the, seeing the other characters in Mario 64 is cooler than the dabbing thing. Who did this one? Scoob? I like this so far. Sometimes when I'm walking down the street, I get the feeling someone's following me. If you think that someone is following you, this is what you Except a little more coherent. Only a little bit, though. Sometimes when 
times when I'm flying in the sky, I get so lost if I fly too high. If you don't know where you've gone to, this is what you do. Look to your right. Look to your right. Look to your left. Look to your left. Look straight ahead. Look straight ahead. Then look behind. have kids you should show them that video immediately what the fuck is this pepito's the world of warcraft story eight minutes hello okay. beautiful lady you like cat um i i guess you buy cat 50 msk cat very good quality Cat, good quality? What What are you talking? Cat, very fresh. You buy a cat? I, I don't really need... You very smart lady. I sell you cat, good deal. What, I, I just, I don't really need a cat. It's not one of my... One cat, 50 MSK. Two cat, seven... Wow, weird. My thing glitched. Now we're watching this video. As I'm in too deep and I'm trying to keep up, up, up in my head instead of going under... Hold on. What if they didn't find my friends? This is Friday night, I could get funkin'. I'm gonna get out of here. God, these fucking videos, dude. You are so beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. What's the song you ring out the loyal I'm an exceptional man for my beautiful daughter. I like how Pets Dogs was in the credits there. Loud and random equals funny? You're right. What is this? Dude's doing like a Final Fantasy battle dance. Okay. Holy shit, he's got little kids in the buckets. It's hard to get out. He gets the entire fucking video in the frame. That's what I look like. That was pretty sick, I like that. Oh god. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Come on, dude. All right, I like that one. <laughs> that one was good. What's this? Oh no. Discord of these videos on um, the dumb fuck videos for stream. Objective Charlie has been lost.
Okay. Elastic Mickey and Donald Duck Femur Breaker Scream. Age restricted. Okay. Captcha. I'm losing my voice right now. I have been doing this for like 10 fucking minutes. Crosswalks. Every fucking where there's a damn crosswalk. Wait five minutes to load some more Hold fucking on, I'll, pictures. I'll do the other one. I'll open Firefox. Oh, great. Now Actually. it's fucking broke. Now it won't give me any more pictures. Is that a crosswalk? Is that a crosswalk? I don't think so. They're all gone. There's none left. Verify! Here we go again. Traffic lights. Boom, boom, boom. Do you count that as a traffic light? I fucking would. Let's do it. No! More traffic lights. This one. This, this, this seems one, like a fucking and that little trailer fucker car hiding boys. back there in the distance. Got your fucking okay. ass. Tell me I'm wrong. Is about traffic lights. Bike, 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 bike. Next. Oh my god. Fucking traffic lights. Next. Oh, it's a crosswalk, actually. It's a crosswalk. It fucked me up. Oh, I'm gonna get this time. Verify. Motherfucker! Motherfucker! I've never had that much trouble with those, have you? I think he- I think he might be exaggerating for the purposes of a funny video. I have, actually. I absolutely have. I hate it. The things people do to make their grandchildren happy. Oh! You know this was some 11 year old's epic idea to get viral famous on TikTok. We have a serious mental illness problem in the United States. No, I, I, I don't. She really went for it though. You don't half ass anything. I think she just really likes pudding. It's when possible. When my roommate comes into the room looking for his car keys, I don't say it yet. And when he gets me off the couch to check underneath the couch cushions, I don't say it yet. No. And then when he says out loud, I wonder where my car keys are, I still don't say it. I still don't say it yet. But then he asks me, do you know where my car keys are? I look at him in his face and I say, Have you checked your bottles? This is autumn. Every fucking time. Without the keyboard. But a funny thing to say to someone. Now I know what to get it for a birthday. When I see the best man start to sweat. I don't say it yet. When I see that little ring bearer cunt getting yelled at by his mum, oh, I still don't say it. When I see the groom asking the vicar if they can wait just another 15 minutes, I do not say it. And when the father of the bride starts organizing an ad hoc evening in the courtyard area, I want to, but I do not say it. It's the 11th hour with 300 congregants under God's roof. The vicar approaches the mic and suddenly all of the chatter goes mute. He says that they've misplaced the rings. Could anyone possibly know where they are? I know it's my time and all heads turn as I stand and say, Vicar, have you checked your bird house? Yeah. My loan. Your I'm losing my patience. Your Where is your class? Up your I just lost my grandma. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Are you capable of not saying she's up my asshole? Of course. My condolences. I'm not looking for a silly joke right now. Yeah, yeah. What are you looking for? Honestly, just like 
a shoulder to cry. Wow. That was that was quite a commitment to the bit. Hello, only friend. Good night. Oh god, what the fuck is, is this? My ancestors are smiling at me, Imperials. And you say the same. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Smiling at me, Imperial. You say the same. I thought that was gonna be dog shit. I thought that one was gonna be like just it ends with him smiling and it's like, haha, epic Skyrim joke. This is the best video of the night. You say the same. Okay. Who fucking Captain Crow uploaded that good job? I am actually in fact, You're taking my my property. A lot of comings and goings of UPS trucks in this neighborhood. What about like, what about a lot that? of packages coming so? to this house particular? Well, something's going on in there. Something's so, going on so in there. It's, it's no, Amazon. I'm taking the package. It's my Amazon I'm wish concerned. list. I'm taking the package. No, you're not taking no, my package. I am. That's no, my excuse stuff. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. me. <laughs> this is fake. I did not. You killed your me. This is fake. You sprayed me. With whatever that thing. Is. Okay, next video. <clears throat> Thank you all of Heath for the 14 months. Have a good night, dude. Thank you. Где свиньи, бля? Народ требует свиньи. Hey, it's the Sith Piggy. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Bloodborne. I was like, that's the first time I got the piggy toy, too. It seems so high. No, these are really... I like the piggy toys. They're fucking funny. This is scary? How is this scary? <laughs> cool. Okay. It's actually the most wholesome video of the night. Oh, fuck. I almost dropped my drink. Jesus. New Glavinous versus Acidic Glavinous Turf War. Okay. Oh, woman! Our queens! If she breathes, she's a fuck! <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you? What the fuck? How? Uh, uh, who? What could possibly compel a man to make something like that? Is it wrong? Yes, that video was dog shit, and let me explain why. Take a look oh, at this. Woman. The acidic one. Our queen. The toxic one. If she breathes, is not the one calling them the thoughts. Fuck? This video is fucking terrible. It's, it's just bad. I like this already.
Acidic does not equal toxic? Sure. But if you were to describe someone as acting in an acidic or vitriolic way, you wouldn't think of them as defending women's honor. You would think of them talking shit on women. It's scared. The crab is terrified. Oh yeah, just shove that entire thing in there. This is the good shit. He's cute. I wonder what his name is. I think he would make a good Charles. What the hell kind of animal is this? This is a pangolin. Is that the noise of it crunching the cracker? I can't really tell. If it's that or the jack -offs making noise in the background. He has pretty eyes. I don't want to tell you my little anecdote. If you ever get stuffed crab, they keep the eyes after they fry it. I couldn't take, I couldn't take it. I felt so guilty, so I plucked them off. Papadap is still here, one of the founders, yeah. There are some people who have been here for like six years or so. Really savoring that chip? He's just having, he's having a good time. He's nice. I don't like when they give you shrimp with ice. Have you ever had to de-vein shrimp? It sucks. It's not fun at all. What's going on, Hoifs? I eat the poop vein? Respectable. The crab was so offended that he was taking the fucking cracker. Man, Captain Crow's posted a lot. Hola, soy Dora. Can you say puedes hacerme un sandwich? That means, can you make me a sandwich in spa- That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay. What the fuck is- Oh no, I think I've seen this one. What's up? What's up? What the fuck's up, <laughs> Dude, holy shit. I would eat at Denny's more often if this is what it was actually like. I'm watching it again. up Denny's oh a torpal duck video oh he sent me some of these listen we don't cotton to freaks round these parts scram weirdo oh yeah I don't poly cotton to coping tropes even my own so why don't you split looks like I already did you're the sad figment of my twisted psyche's tragic dividend you're the un me I'm the real me you wanna be me kiddo I was the real me when you were still in my short pants hate to break it to you but I wore them first me bequeathed the the psychopathological huh? hand you down so you're the one who stained them whoever found it browned it You'd like me to be you, wouldn't me? But it's too late. You snows, you lows, you sleeped, you weep, you nap, -a. you get slap, -a. you slumber, a cucumber, you catch up on some zeds, you get out of my head, you slumber, 
Hamburger. I don't want to talk about nothing else. Listen, this psyche is not big enough for two metaphysical seekers. You couldn't seek your way out of a cardboard bag. Yeah, I know, because it would be an egg. Ooh, this guy might be better than me. You're right. I am better than me. Look, buddy, know when you're defeated. Accept your defecation. No thanks. I'm full, because I eat pussies like you for breakfast. Look at you. You look so superficial. You probably judge things by their physical appearance. Oh, yeah? Your mom's so shallow, she probably thinks this quip is about her. You're about as deep as a bowl of soup, and your tongue is about as sharp as a soup spoon. Hey, say what you want about me, but lay off the soup. If you love soup so much, why don't you marry soup? Because I'm already married to justice. Yeah, only a blind girl would marry you. I know everything you're gonna say, and I know everything you're gonna don't. Oh yeah? Well, when God was passing out insight, you thought he said that when God was passing out holy prophets, you thought he said oily faucets, cause your soul has diarrhea of the mouth. Faucet. Are you so dumb you even answer rhetorical questions? I don't know. Do you? We can play this game all night. First <laughs> God, this is sexy, is it? You think so? I'm gonna get some booze. I wish I had booze. You have no idea. What is this? TikTok truly is a, is no man's land, huh? That's fucking awful. Oni plays animated Carl the Brain Cell. Oni plays! Do you remember that part of the Jimmy Neutron movie, um, where Carl, they talk about puberty, they're like laying the little fucking stupid asteroid and Carl's like, Oh, I get my first pube! Yeah, and he's like, Hey Jim, you wanna join Antifa? Hey, hey, Jimmy! <laughs> Jimmy, <laughs> you wanna, Jimmy, go to the Brain Cell subreddit! <laughs> It'll really change, but it'll explain why Cindy doesn't love you. It's because you're a sub-8 male. <laughs> you're, you're a new male, Jimmy. You're a new male, Jimmy. Don't take the red pill. That's for cucks who... No, to... Jimmy, take the red pill! <laughs> <laughs> I love the red pill! Is, is that, that that's Sheen? Yeah. The MRA is the only way to go. <laughs> that's, what Cle that's like a Quagmire family guy. That's not even... Yeah. A... Yeah, 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 yeah. That's okay. the black pill, Jimmy. That's, that's the biggest black pill of all. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy got a brain blast when he went to the brain cell subreddit. <laughs> what the fuck? What the hell did I just watch? Okay, let's do the next one. Oh, this looks good. Air conditioner and smart. Yeah, my bad. Ah. Let me turn this up. Hey, thank you, Nan the Wiser, for the nine month resub. I appreciate it. This video is really fucking quiet. familiar with the noises these guys make. Is that like a noise of jubilation? Yeah? Okay, that's what I thought, but I wasn't sure. It's so weird that they make that noise. Have you ever heard what baby rhinos sound like? Even just regular rhinos sound really weird. They're cute. The 
and then your children are turned into mindless vassals who do now, they, they look up to some twit instead of looking up to Thomas Jefferson or, or looking up to Nikola Tesla or looking up to, uh, to Magellan. I mean, kids, Magellan's a lot cooler than Justin Bieber. He circumnavigated with one ship the entire planet. He was killed by wild natives before they got back to Portugal. And when they got back, there was only like 11 people alive of the 200-something crew. And the entire ship was rotting down to the waterline. That's destiny. That's will. That's striving. That's being a trailblazer and explorer. Going into space, mathematics, quantum mechanics, the secrets of the universe. It's yeah. all there. Life is fiery. Why not beauty. just post it's the Alex Jones detail. video? Tuning into it. You can't, I, I think that's what this is. There's, you can't improve upon perfection. Why do you need like the Transformers reskin? Just post the actual video and it's like 50 times better every, every single time without fail. It was like that with the, the fucking like anime version of him too. Oh, no, I was, no, 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 no. I'm not, I'm not. Like, oh my God. I'm just saying in general, like, it doesn't make sense to me why people make these in the first place. That's awesome. What's this guy doing? Because democracy basically means... Government... <laughs> the people of the people for the people okay but the people are retarded <laughs> holy fuck I like this guy <laughs> that is not what I was expecting him to say. Because it's like, he seemed like he was really struggling with his English at the beginning. So, I'm surprised he whipped that word out. Oh, what is this? Are you wearing glasses? Yes. Are you bald? Yeah. Do you wear sneakers with jeans? Yes. Did you have a son in 1996? Yes. Was his name Connor? Yes. Dad? That's right, son. I thought you were dead. I've returned to ask you one thing. Anything. Why are you sitting in my chair? Later, man, Kate King. Oh, all right. The Magical Cafe. I'll just get a medium long black. Welcome to my magical cafe. I can make you a coffee that will keep you awake forever. All I need is your first born son. Holy fuck! Yeah. Yeah. That homeless lady's back giving people cups of her piss. Sounds like a good time to me. Who posted this? Who likes Cracker Milk? Dude, what the fuck? Captain Crow posted like a wall of shit. Okay, if, I like this one, and that redeems it, but these are fucking weird. Ah, oh, fuck you! Hey, fuck you, man! Hey, fuck you, mate! Go fuck yourself! Why don't you go fuck yourself? Cunt! I've kept your receipt, and I'm taking you straight back to Ikea. Now what's going on? Please sit on my face. Is this... is... Uh, oh no, there's more. Okay. Mm. No more? We have to. They're only like... Oh, oh I left. Sauce. What? Do you like sauce? Yeah. Well, let me give you sauce. 
Well, okay. Um, what is this one? Oh God. Hey, I know uh, what this is. Just wondering, is this uh, an out of season April Fool's joke? Uh, no, it's it's a it's a fully uh, fully fledged uh, Diablo experience on on mobile, which everybody will get to play, and hopefully, which will bring new heroes to Sanctuary as well as <laughs> welcoming our community back into it, and yep. something we're very excited about. I don't have a phone. I'm Diablo's worst nightmare. I won't be able to play it. World's lowest sheesh. Oh. All right, I'm attempting the world's lowest sheesh. <clears throat> this is something Torpal would put in Hand of Doom. <laughs> that's absolutely something Torpal would do. That's it. That's it. Who? I'm surprised Torpal didn't upload that. Okay, world's cleanest milk. The milk I'm about to drink is the world's cleanest milk. It has no lactose, no cholesterol, and it doesn't even come from an animal. This is the world's first milk that is made without a cow. And these guys made it. <laughs> Ildaka, long video. How to make duck let Christmas dinner ideas? Motherfucker, what are you trying to suggest to me? How long is this? 17 Hello minutes? Hello everyone and welcome back to the French Cooking Academy channel. Nope. Okay. I was doing some gardening in my backyard today, and I uncovered some sort of crazy secret concrete box in the ground. Found a handle after digging for a while, and after digging for a bit more, I uncovered the second handle. I kept going and got clean to the point where I could start to uh, attempt to lift it up. When I tried, it was a little heavy, so then I brought in the big guns, and you'll never believe what I found. They were in a septic tank. <laughs> what a fucking idiot, dude. Jesus. <laughs> it's fake of course but that one was at least executed well hey the big man's back www.thekidfrombrooklyn.com I like this you guy you see them signs on the highway billboards years ago I'd walk a mile for a camel Oh, they used to have cigarette commercials. The guy used to say I'd walk a mile for a camel. Well, let me tell all you young people out there. The big man would walk 20 miles for a quaalude. Let me tell you. <laughs> that was the drug back there in the late 70s and 80s. Quaaludes. The good old Aurora 714. And they changed it to lemon. I tell you. I will get a couple of them fucking lemons now. That was the best fucking drug ever made. It was so fucking good. The government took them off the fucking market because they were, they were putting the fucking drug dealers out of fucking business. <laughs> not narcotic, not addictive. Bring back the fucking quaaludes. You can take all the fucking cocaine, marijuana, and all them fucking designer drugs they make today and stick them up your fucking ass. There's nothing like a fucking quaalude. Is this a bad time? I tell you, they fucking best to say that I don't know what a quaalude is. A quaalude, you thought you died and went to heaven. Let me tell you. And when you had an orgasm, you thought you were on a fucking moon. <laughs> Bring back that fucking quaaludes. Anyway, think about it. This is the big man, the voice, the voice of the people. <laughs> Aurora 714. <laughs> I like this guy. Always. Oh. 
I want to see this see. guy play Dark Souls. What's this one? Who's posting these? Jerg? Jerg's posted a lot, rat. too. Is this. The rats are all like this. The rat goes like this. So the rat's That's like true. this. The normal rat is like this. That's the normal rat. Like this. Like this. I want to see the sniffs. abnormal rat. It's like this for quite a while. He's like this. It's. I'm a, and then maybe he sniffs. You are now a normal rat. That's excellent. That's great. I'm normal? It was two days after Thanksgiving, and this girl from Tinder hit me up, and she's like, come over. And of course I did. So I'm sitting there. She invites me over. She sits me down on this oversized bean bag that she had. First red flag. Then she was like, hey, what's <laughs> How up? is that a red so flag? Mind you, dude, like I said, it was like a day or two after Thanksgiving. So I'm eating Thanksgiving leftovers, and I'm having Thanksgiving leftover you farts and everything. I mean, it's bad. Bags. So I get to her house. I'm laying on the bean bag. She starts topping me up. And then I'm like, okay, this is normal, this is cool. And I start pushing on her head. Come on, baby, let's go deeper. And she goes like this, takes my hands, bah, bah. And she goes, that's the funny thing about guys. Grabs my legs, they always think they're in control. And fucking throws my legs, I mean, I'm telling you like this. She was like, <laughs> was like ma'am, ma'am, what are we doing? And she just started eating my fucking ass, bro, just going to town on that shit. And I didn't shower, I mean, nothing, man. And I'm telling you, that was probably the kinkiest experience I ever had. Anyways, dog, I gotta go. I'll see y'all later. I don't believe him. Listen up. That guy, he wants six million pizzas. Six million pizzas? We only have four ovens, boss. How we get... Oh, hey, babe. <sighs> What the fuck is this? It might have the Star Wars Lego set Death Star, but can he chug a sparkling water and not burp? Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Uh, what do I do? <laughs> Customer complaint. Skid steer has lack of power. I wonder why. Let's open the trunk. Here, let's check the air filter real quick. Just uh, Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness gracious. Just a little tap, tap, tap. Tap, tap. Oh, my goodness. Huh. This does not look right, does it now? No, it does not. Holy fuck. This also reminds me of the trailer park. I Boys. wonder the... why it has a lack of power. Holy shit. The fucking post is covered. Now we're just going to keep going. Holy fuck. What the fuck? That's it's disgusting. Yeah, I wonder why it had a lack of power. Holy shit. This is Father Wubby. I, I need to confess a sin, Father. I worked at a grocery store in my teenage years. I won't get specific. There was this one girl. Are you familiar with the term gumping it? Uh, Father Wubby is not familiar with the term uh, gumping it. So gumping it is when someone is not quite retarded. But they're like just <laughs> on that line. So while it's an ethical <laughs> conundrum, it's not fucking a retarded person if you were to sleep with them. This will come important later in the story. She worked in the bakery. And to cut to the chase, because I've already taken a minute of your time, Father. You're good. I fucked her ass in the freezer. <laughs> I learned a new term today. Oh, look, it's a shrigma male. Mushroom mess. Mushroom mess. Whatever could it mean? It means you've lived a life of sin. Okay. Imagine Tolo doing a call-in stream. That would be fun, but I have a feeling there would be people who would just yell racial epithets. You know? I don't know how I would go about screening people. Fuck you, cocksucker. 
Maybe only do long term subs. No, because that's kind of that's lame. I don't want to be like, yeah, I'm only doing this if you've given me money for a prolonged period of time, you know? Listen to me, girl. This is your bum. Damn. Now stand up and sit down. Call me daddy. Sit down and call me daddy now. <laughs> stand up now. Put your arms behind your head and shut up. Call me daddy. Sit down. Stupid bitch whore. Stupid whore bitch. Do you want me to spank you one more time? Stupid bitch whore. Sit down on your hands and your arms. Put your face between your armpit and scream. Good girl. I am daddy and this is Valentine's Day. This is the... I'm not an expert on daddies. But this is not, not what I picture when I think of a big, a big daddy. I want to watch that again, actually. Listen to me, girl. I'm transfixed. This is your bum. Your bum? Now stand up and sit down. Call me daddy. Sit down and call me daddy now. Stand up now. Put your arms behind your head and this shut like the up. average Discord moderator. Sit down. Stupid bitch whore. Stupid whore bitch. Do you want me to spank you one more time? Stupid bitch whore. Sit down on your This hands This reminds me of something Put your fucking face terrible. Between your armpit and scream. Good girl. I am daddy and this is Valentine's Day. There was a fucking girl who was talking to me who was kind of like um God, how do I describe this? She 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 knew cry in his harem. And apparently there was one chick in the harem who was obsessed with cry being a daddy and it's just like I can't envision that in a million fucking years, you know? It's that's what this fucking reminds me of. I want to watch it again. Maybe I'm a li maybe this dude turns me on. Driving down the road and the wind is blowing like crazy. And I asked myself, why is it always so windy down here on the coast? Well, then I figured it out. Fans, fans, some lunatic put a bunch of giant <laughs> fans all over this place and left them running. Look at that, look at that thing. It's causing this wind. Oh fans, my God. I simply cannot believe somebody would do that. What's How going on, DG? We're watching videos. Think about the amount of electricity we're wasting by running these it's fans satire. 24 hours a day. It's and satire. What? There's no Just way. to blow a bunch of air around. It makes There's no, no way. sense. This is America. No. We shouldn't be wasting our money on Once he like said this. the electricity thing, it was satire 100%. Hours a day. And to do what? Can you imagine how much erosion this is causing out here? Think of all the dirt that's being blown around. All because some genius puts up giant fans. And look, they're everywhere. They are absolutely everywhere. Listen to the wind that they cause. Listen to this. Listen. Yeah, that was come because on. of a giant fan. So okay, let, let, let's talk about this. This video is absolutely fake. There's no, there's no way you could ever believe that this is real. There's no way, but it's still funny because you know that when you make a video like this, you think you're being satirical and you think you're being funny and you're you're trying to be a funny man. The reason it's funny is because idiots are gonna watch this and be like, "Yeah, this guy's right. This guy, he's got a good head on his shoulders." And there are people who actually believe this shit, but this guy doesn't. I don't believe it for a second. Here it thinks we live in a simulation. Do live in a simulation. I'm convinced. I think it's time we expose the truth. Oh, the truth, huh? Yes. You want the truth? You're not ready for the truth. <laughs> I love that. The hell was that? What are you talking about? It's from that booth. That's not how the line goes. It's you can't handle the truth. Remember it the other way. Oh, maybe it's the Mandela effect. What's that? Shit that changes whenever they update the simulation we live in. If it's a simulation, then make something happen. We don't control the simulation. It may even be other beings that are watching us right now. All right, all right, stop. If this is a simulation being controlled by other beings, then let's test it. Hello, other beings. If you're out there, show us a sign. What if I just turn around right now and see Batman? I mean, that's neat, I guess. 
Good evening, Kerry. Oh, fuck, you, not you, this asshole. Good evening, Kerry, you fit blonde. Stephen D here from Asherton Kent. A big fan of yours and a big fan of Bay Station too. Will you be showing your... I hope you've been showing your pussy tonight, baby, <laughs> because I will be wanking my cock when you get fucking naked, <laughs> as you usually do on Bay Station X anyway. Don't forget, don't forget to bloody swear, Kerry. ding a dong Oh my god, what's wrong with the fucking, what's wrong with the people on the other side of the pond? Are you sober now? No, no, yeah, yeah. I, I never, but I, I, I'm always, uh, I, I'll turn it. Yeah. Awesome. Yep, here he comes. Red. <laughs> <laughs> They cut the video because they lost. Cool idea. I guarantee you they lost that fight. Hello, everybody. My name is Matti, and I'm from Finland. I hate him already. Today, in Finland, the parliament vote about the equal right for homo to marry. Mm -hmm. And there are people who say... No homo. No homo in Finland. But I say... No... No homo. In Finland, we homo. And even myself... I think you must have for 18 months. But I wish that in Finland... Everyone can homo in marriage. <laughs> For free. For <laughs> free, okay. And that's it. That's a good message. Goodbye. That's a good message. I, I like him. I changed my mind. No, 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 I didn't think he's Kai who would survive. <laughs> What is this? My husband says he's upset with me because in his words, sweetie, you need to stop spending so much money on DoorDash. Ordering it three times a day is not appropriate and we need to start living within our means. Honey, it sounds like you have an income problem, not that I have a spending problem. Start earning more money and we won't have these issues. So I took his credit card that we share and I booked a vacation for my daughter Richard and I. We're staying in a hotel tonight. And I hope he enjoys that I charged $8,000 to his credit card. Make more money, darling. Fake? I want to say it's fake. But once again, it's one of those videos where this one might be fake, but there are absolutely people like this. So it's, it's still like a representation of something, you know, that actually happens. So it's kind of funny in that sense, I guess. But that's probably fake. Um. So you like to play? Whoa! What? Snake, what's he doing? I'm not sure. I, I mean, wow, man! You, you play a lot of porn games in your free time. Oh, okay, what? okay. This was going to be a cute little moment where I was going to blow your mind. But now, gee! I have no idea what you're talking about. Pokemon, Crash Bandicoot. Minecraft. Well, I mean, that's a bit better. I didn't even know how you'd make a sex game out of <laughs> Minecraft. But, but here we are. Never mind. Is there anything you've played that doesn't include dick and balls? Well, I've played Angry Birds a couple of times. There's uh, that. Yeah, they're oh, yes. See? This can still be salvaged. Let me just know. Why does that exist? I regret nothing. What the fuck? Oh no, what is this? This chick is shit. Look at that. Bite me. Bite me. He, this damn snake won't bite me. You know why? Because I got the best food shine around. <laughs> this bitch is too scared to bite me. Look at him. <laughs> bite me, boy. Bite me. <laughs> I like
like that noise. <laughs> wow. That, he's a fucking character. Oh, this looks good. Hello, my name is Buddy. I'm Monkey. He's not a monkey. You're Stinky Monkey. He's not a monkey. Shut the fuck up, bitch. Your memes aren't funny. Cry. <laughs> Who's that behind you? That's my mom. Your mama's so fat she is die. I'll fuck her with this banana. Alright. That's not a monkey. That pisses me off. I'm looking for a laptop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have uh, this is our cheaper laptop, 500 ringgit only. More expensive have or not? Oh, have, 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 sir. This one, 700 Koi Fi. 700 only, yeah. Is that all you have? Uh, so, sir, uh, what's your budget? What? What budget? You think I don't have money, man? You see here, how much or not? More than you want, man, of salary, you know or not? Hey, who are you? I'm Don Allen. I know you are rich, but we respect our staff. My company don't welcome this type of disrespectful customer. Please leave our staff. What the fuck was that? Okay. I guess that was I mean, an advertisement. It sounds kind of macabre, but I like to go to uh, visit a country after a terrorist attack. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Hold on. After a terrorist attack, you know, the horse has already left the barn. It's cheap. And I went no, to Istanbul right. after they had that bombing at the airport. So I yeah, went no, there. Right. Jesus Christ. And there was a bus. Was supposed I think to be you messed north from 68 months recently. I appreciate Two. it. How are you, dude? You. Uh, so I got the whole tour. <laughs> and they're like, why are you the here? The whole bus. And I stayed at a $300 a night hotel for 30 bucks. Oh, my God. Yeah. Uh, I was in Morocco after they chopped off two two uh, girls' heads off. <laughs> and, and I was on this trail, got... on the same trail that they were on. <laughs> so wait, Dang, when you shit, read dude. the news of a terrorist attack, you're like, time to hit orbit. <laughs> so, I but mean... you, you get really good deals, and, and the security is fantastic. <laughs> well, I've gotten flights to Peru. Round trip for 280 bucks. Wow. And what happened right before that? Oh, there, there was probably an earthquake. <laughs> <laughs> so 9-12-2001, you're on a flight to New York. <laughs> you're like, let's do this. <laughs> My dad did that. We went to Disney after 9-11, dude. It was fucking empty. It was the most magical experience ever going to Disney World because everyone was like scared to shit to fly. And it was like less than five minutes for any ride you wanted to go on. It, it will never nothing will ever live up to that amusement park exper experience it was fucking amazing this dude's 100 percent right um maybe not so much in the modern day but if anyone ever like hijacks a plane and explodes it again that's when that's time to fly um it's fucked up but that's he's, he's not wrong this at all he's the neighborhood and you are not welcome oh okay that's why i need you're a goddamn hero, you know that, kid. Heroes have to make sacrifices. That's why when I ask you for one more, I hope you understand. It was never personal. <laughs> the fuck? Okay, what's the rest of this one? be here. Tags, anal, big tits, cream pie, resource management. <laughs> Why would you go back? I wanted to see. Well, I keep pausing it because you keep covering your eyes. I didn't understand. You're scared of insidious? <laughs> uh, do you want me to put on the wiggles or something? Would that make you more? Yeah. Okay, so, no, this is not a scary movie. Uh, true horror would be something like Terminator. Uh, that should scare humans. Flying too close to the sun, their own hubris melting their wings of wax. Uh, the fruits of their labor leading them like lambs to the slaughter. Is a writer, director... Uh, these movies don't scare me because I'm too focused on the technical aspects of the film. The mise-en-scene. I don't feel fear, as you would put it. Okay, well, that doesn't count. It's not true. I'm not scared of the rain. I just can't go outside when it's raining. Of course, it reminds me of the day they found me. 
Of course, horror movies pale in comparison to the horrors that go on in my head. Of course, I don't. That's awful. That's fucking awful. What's going on? I eat food. That's accurate, though. Hello, Desperado Joe. <laughs> As awful as the video was. So when the pandemic started, I thought it was a joke too. And so I bought okay. something. And it was freaking awesome. Until I figured out that you cannot breathe in this son of a bitch. Oh, wow. As awful as the video was, what do you mean? I won't blame you if you never do video night ever again. Well, a lot of people have, have been pretty... And I don't know. It hasn't been a particularly resounding success. Last chance to but that's okay. Me, it has Morrowind health bars, so that's... God damn it. Uh, I love Morrowind. That's the fastest way to make me happy is posting a shitty Morrowind meme. Let's paint a picture. You are grocery shopping at your local okay. Tesco when an 85-year-old loon lobs a grenade at your shopping trolley and explodes as your groceries, runs out of the store, escapes via the tube station across the street, takes the tube to London Street Pancras Railway Station, and boards the 7.55 a.m. Eurostar service to Paris nor in France. The fuck Hundreds is of this video? Of are now burning in front of you. Is this image familiar to you? Yeah. Of course it is. Many people often suffer from the same experience, and it is because they have made a fatal mistake in their shopping routine. Do you see it? The answer is obvious. Your shopping trolley is an unarmored target with no method of defending itself, which is an invitation for disaster. Today, we will show you how to modify your shopping trolley to successfully shop at a Tesco Express in the dangerous area that I is I don't know how much more I can take of these videos. Let's begin by upgrading the armament. This is corroding my will to live. a 12.7 mm M2HB Browning heavy machine gun, plus another for anti-aircraft purposes against aerial attacks, and a Just few more... Just watch the funny ones. Them. I have no idea which ones those are going to be. I haven't seen any of these before. The active protection system as a countermeasure against anti I'm learning a lot about my chat sense of humor rocket though rocket propelled grenades anti tank rockets and high explosive anti tank rounds the system uses a self forging this reminds me of chrome house coming threats by preemptively detonating the projectile our shopping trolley is thus no longer vulnerable to a multitude of threats you may encounter the only thing that our shopping trolley cannot effectively defend against now are kinetic energy penetrators, which is why we will mount ATGM launchers on our shopping trolley to penetrate the enemy before the enemy Close penetrates the crush. trolley. As you may have noticed, the additional weight of the modifications we well, have installed on like, our I don't shopping know, I don't trolley have one. has made it impractical for manual propulsion. We can solve this problem by mounting a 5.4 liter 12 cylinder twin turbocharged petrol engine producing 1100 brake horsepower at 7800 rpm and 5 speed manual transmission. Thanks to the light, I can't talk to my sense of humor trolleys, is fucking we ridiculous can too. An optimal power to weight ratio, which gives a shopping trolley extremely high acceleration and top My speed favorite is Sands it's Dies of Cancer ASMR. That's what I find funny. And also do some sick outside overtakes because I'm on sick. Turns. I'm fucked in the head. We will now test our modifications by placing our improved shopping trolley in the same situation again. If your sense of humor isn't exactly the same as mine, you're incorrect, you're right. Okay. McDonald's Big Mac. See, I wish we could watch the ones where, like, the dude is just fucking the McChicken. Oh, no. Hello, and welcome Hi. to Henry's Kitchen, where today, I'm going to be teaching you how to make the authentic McDonald's-style Big Mac. I hate the Big Mac. You know, the other day, my little nephew asked if I could take him to McDonald's. And I was like, if 
fuck that. Let's just make a Big Mac right here at home. So today, I'm going to be teaching you how to make that Big Mac. Okay. Just like Mom used to get from McDonald's. You can start by making some special sauce. You want two Disgusting, cups of mayonnaise. Disgusting, dude. Two tablespoons Thousand Islands dressing. I'm going to fucking throw and up. two tablespoons of this stuff. <laughs> stuff? Was that fucking relish? You know, the term what special was that? sauce was invented by a guy named Jim Delgatti back in 1967. And he had no idea that one day people all over the world would be laughing at that term. Now let's just make these into patties. Is this like case cooking? You guys probably remember the catchy theme song from the 1970s. Two all beef patties, special sauce, onions, lettuce, cheese, onions, pickles, special sauce. Okay. Pickles. Okay, so we're just going to put these on the burner. I've got a lightly greased burner here. The patties are completely Maybe fucking this be uneven. Maybe time to check our viewer mail. Let's go through some of our viewer mail here. Brittany in Lexington, Kentucky writes... I've noticed you've gained weight and gotten older since your earlier videos, and it also <laughs> looks my... like you're losing yeah. your hair. Yeah, yeah. I, okay, so yeah, I this is a question that. that I've gotten a couple of times, and uh, <laughs> me too, dude. Yeah, I mean, uh, <laughs> me too. We at Henry's Kitchen are definitely aware of this uh, problem, and we're trying <laughs> to fix it the best that we can. <laughs> I fucking like this okay, guy. Okay, so now we're going to prep our buns. And what's unique about the Big Most Mac these bun videos is there's actually That's good. I like being uncomfortable and watching videos. I like the, the shitty cringe videos the most. Back bun, middle bun, and then what we call the front bun. And um, we're going to take a... Because humor is often way is too subjective to have like a large amount of people. I'm just going to take a sharpie. Think something is funny, right? I'm but something that's awful and cringy, like lid. Foam Adventure... Everybody like so. finds that shit uncomfortable, so you get solidarity. So that this is going to form sort of a when you watch something like stencil, that, right? If you will. What the fuck is and he doing? What I'm going to do next is I'm going to take our scissors, and I'm just going to cut around. The this is how Jack in the Box makes their fucking burgers. Around our line. You know the Big Mac actually you can taste revolutionized the, in the bun situation. You want to make sure you get all of that ink off, because that definitely will kill you. <laughs> okay, we're getting pretty close here. I've got some sliced cheddar cheese, and I'm also going to take a stick of butter, and I'm just going to slide it across my buns. Yeah, <laughs> you slide it across your buns. So we can get them now. nice and toasty. All right. Okay, these are looking pretty good. I'm just going to add our slices Ooh, they look like of cheese. Meatballs. Onto the patties. <laughs> However much you can fit on there. What the fuck? Let's just cover that up and let it get melted. Now it's time to cut up our veggies. You can start by dicing the onion. <laughs> Dice the pickles. It's funny how many people will go to McDonald's and spend... Who knows how much money on a Big Mac when they can just make it at home? <laughs> People are so stupid. <laughs> yeah. What's with the fucking music? That upsets me so much how the fucking burger patty doesn't fill out the bun at all. That's terrible, dude. It looks like a fucked up mushroom. Okay, now it looks... That's not the one he made. Delicious. Well, thanks again for joining me, everybody. And as always, I want to thank the patrons at Patreon slash Henry's Kitchen for keeping these videos alive. See you next month. I like that one. That was good. Oh boy, here we fucking go. You, I... You know about this because of me. This is the sort of shit that I do.
In like seven minutes. Recording. Oh, oh god, I think it's recording. Hey there, you guys are looking lively. Demix here, rocking it out. Are we looking lively? Happy New Year's to you all. It's currently 2008, which makes it year of the axle. Whose year is it next? Now I bet you guys are wondering. Wait a second, Demix. Didn't you die? Well, actually, no. If you look carefully, I use clone ninjutsu. Yeah, don't doubt my awesome ninja abilities. Okay. I bet you guys are also wondering, Demix, what are you doing on YouTube? Well, Mantec finally caved into me and gave me my own channel to broadcast off of to give you guys an update on what There are like 50 episodes of this shit, by the way. Demix, remember when you're making this to think of we should box. do a stream where we watch I all like of it. Box, What's going on, Yasami? This is Demix time. I feel safe inside of it. Anyway, so, um, let's start with our first section, which is... What Demix found in the other guys' rooms. So, what did I find in the other members' rooms this week? Well, from Luxard's room, I found chocolate digestive. Those brats know how to make cookies, I can tell you that. And from Vexen's room, I managed to get... Opening a new tab? Oh, <laughs> come know. on. Come no, on. Cool. No, no, I should, I should. This is what old YouTube was like. <sighs> you can tell this is a relic of the internet. <laughs> I like Reply oh, Girls well, better. This is throwing off again. I'll see Wait, you later, Tolo. Really goodbye. Dam dam cam. I'm gonna hide in my porn so, server. Dem, Call dem, me when it's over. Section. This is where I've taken a small little camera and planted it. Torpal's just room. upset because it's like looking into so, a mirror as someone who likes Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> you bastard, tell the truth. Okay, I really love you. I love you too, man. Why do you torture us? I'm not the one who picked this video. I only have the one Riku action figure. Does that bother you? I could get you another one. Gross. Forge meeting. Recording. Now we're on to what did we discuss in the organization? Yes, Beardy, I did. Well, Zemnus wasn't very happy this week since he found out that the organization's budget has all been spent on hair products. Well, we have to look good when we're being evil, Zemnus. How come we never have orgy have meetings anymore? Because everyone cow. laughs at my baby dick. Look! That's stupid! That's stupid! But the uh, main issue that was brought up this week was sexual harassment in the workplace. Now, I don't know if you're aware of this, but did you know if someone touches you and you don't want them to touch you, that counts as sexual harassment, okay. and you can sue them for everything they're worth. True. Axel, you're so screwed. Demix yeah. concludes. Okay. What's now, going on, Potato Lord? We're doing user-submitted videos. So, this one's my fault, because I showed my stream these videos. This week is this one. Careful for the music at the end. Okay. Oh my god, dude. It feels like I've been watching this for half an hour. And my mother does them. Finished watching the Jimmy and the Pulsating Mass Vods. Good shit. Isn't that cute? Hope you liked so, it. So that bad wraps it up for this week. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you have any questions or requests, please send them to dancedemicstance at hotmail.co.uk. Okay. No thanks. <laughs> Holy shit. I like the thumbnail for that one. What is that? Funniest live TV news interviews gone wrong? Oh god, who posted this? This is a Torpal Duck video. Let's watch everybody. I will defeat your existence with my killing power. Get ready because your behind is gonna get walloped. False. It is you who will kick the bucket in 10 seconds. Just you wait. You fool. Watch I'm trying to be lost. Maybe. Speak. Thank you, Zidane. I don't know what's coming How to are you. you?
What the fuck is wrong with you, Sleepy? Oh, you're in the right place. I thought this was gonna be a good video. What the fuck is- what the fuck is this? Sleepy but I must game, what are you playing? <laughs> I, I, I figure you are. That makes sense. What is... Okay. Okay. Final Fantasy 14. I, I'm kind of tempted to try 14 again one of these days. After I'm done with Morrowind in three years. Later, Team Paul. I feel like I'm the only person in the world who isn't playing Final Fantasy XIV at this point. What the fuck is happening? I don't know, but I like it. Ten times per second. Yeah, that's fair. What is this? Oh, God damn it. What the fuck? Why would you post this, bandit? Oh, this is a good video. T O L O. Dolo, hey. Keep a happy thought. Be safe, be well, be awesome. That's a good video. What? Oh, yeah. You said I could get on if I had a worm. Oh, okay. You guys said I could get on if I had. And they, earlier he said I could get on. Dude, Paul, is it cool if I come in? Come on, you said I could come no, on it's earlier. The same people as before, we don't have enough seats. You said I could, and I just ate a worm and shit. Right. Dude, it's sketchy out here. I don't have yeah. to walk back through well, there. I mean, why'd you come here? I came here to see you guys. You said I could come with you. <laughs> Holy fuck! This is like hanging out with frat dudes. Whatever. It's cool. See, these are the frat guys of the internet, guys. The Jake Pauls of live streaming. Damn. Okay. Oh no. I, I I don't remember the last time I opened a video hoping for good things. I think it was the cat video actually. And I got this. Okay, what's this? Hi. Um, a couple, two, three days ago, something happened in TV history. The well-known Family Guy show just killed off one of its biggest... Four and a half fucking minutes. ...characters. Let us please... Let Brian Griffin rest, rest in peace. Holy shit. Please let him rest in peace. Fucking skip. No, I kind of want to see this. Berlin, put him back on the show. No, that most of no. them are supposed to be yes. like um, miserable. Animation nomination. Since McFarlane thought he could just 
put a twist on on a show. Some of them and have been funny though. Kill off Brian. And after Brian got hit by that car, <laughs> this is so stupid, dude. Was shocked. Everybody that, every viewer that was watching Family Guy that night got, was shocked and scared. <laughs> and then later on in the show, <laughs> um, <laughs> after the veterinarian said that Brian w wouldn't be making it, um, the saddest part happened. Brian said his foul words that everybody started crying. Yes, this was a sad day in TV history. Alright, but right after that, they went to a pet shelter. And they found a new dog named Vinny. Now, it sounds like one of those guys from, like, the Mafia or something. What the fuck? So, they bought Vinny. What would compel Vinny someone to make this a video? Guy in on, on everyone's good side of the family, except for Stewie. Stewie's still... Dear God Almighty. Followage, you can click on your name and it should show you. I don't have a bot in the chat. No. Around the end, Vinny finally gets um on the good side of Stewie. But what I believe is it's going to be a part one, part two episode where like Vinny turns out to be like vote skip no no and then we we skip Demix time we have to watch like, this one goes in and attacks Vinny. Or somehow gets the part in a couple episodes and brings Brian back to life. Well, that that's not going to be until um until next week. Imagine if you had a kid but and it started making right YouTube videos like this. Air, the internet blew up. You got Tumblr blowing up. You got Tumblr. YouTube blowing up. Everything is still about Brian Griffin's death. <laughs> and oh my God, how miserable! Brian rest in peace. And hopefully, Seth MacFarlane does the right thing and brings him back. Oh, and how long has it been? And Four um, minutes. This, the video. Apparently, the new dog is going to take Brian's place in the opening credits. Yeah. So, can't wait till next week to see what's happening. And, wrap the episode. Get back to you guys. See. Ya. Oh wow. VHS found footage 1999 house party. It's Richard. He says we can Nice. Do you, do you even know these people? It's a party. We'll get to know them. Hey, are you sure this is his house? Yeah, it's the one with the blue shutters. Richard! Richard! Whoa! Cool UPS jacket! Well, hey, I found a balloon! Me too! <laughs> Jesus. That's not how you do it, you idiot. God damn it. Hey, that looks pretty good. Thanks, man. Let's go. We've been exploring together. I think the party's downstairs. Let's check it out. Max. Richard, we're here. Max? Must have gone ahead. Well, I guess Max couldn't wait. I'm gonna go join him at the party. The battery's getting pretty low, so. Bye bye. That feels like I've played 50 fucking itch.io horror games that had that as a plot.
Hey, thank you, Dog Machines, for the 67 months. I appreciate it, dude. How are you? A minute and 37 seconds of a monkey eating. It's not a monkey, but... Oh, those lip smacks. Seems like I'm never here, but hey, I'm here. I'm sorry. It's good to see you, dude. Just life, yeah. That's how it goes sometimes. Would you have a watch party for tomorrow the movie? Of course. You skipped Demix, but not this shit? Do you not like the monkey eating? This is a good fucking video. Fuck you. There's a goat in the background too that's jealous. He's hungry. They eat too much like us? It's gross? I don't eat like that! If you eat like this gorilla, you have a problem. My grandfather does. Is your grandfather a gorilla? Close your mouth? Yeah. I don't know. I don't mind animal eating noises. Holy shit, what did he see? What did he see, dude? That's- this is like the fucking people who eat during Tolomeo streams. Like, they come to the pre-stream and they're eating. And then I start talking about Jimin and the piss jars. Or- or, or the cum sock family. And... They just fucking... They just don't know what to do. <laughs> Maybe the goat turned around. <laughs> Come on, dude. videos, dude. Come on. He's just eating ice cream. He's having the time of his life. He doesn't even know what ice cream is. Imagine you're eating leaves and shit and suddenly someone brings you into the house and gives you fucking ice cream for the first time. You'd be the happiest fucking thing on the planet. Oh my god. Oh, Sushi posted a video. This is gonna be awful, isn't it? Let's I ain't never seen no muzzle on that, but it might be good, though. My daddy know about it. I'm about to get to him. Squirt it all around, and then I'm gonna rub it smooth oh, everywhere. Oh, mustard. And what I'm Come doing on, is man. Now, don't put no muzzle on. You need to put a little seed on that thing. Stick to it. What? Man, come on, now. Get that pimp off there. Come on, somebody come get this, man. Come on, now. Come on, get that pimp off. That's just too much doggone pimp. I don't really want to see this no more. That's really all you want for a brisket? God! Oh my God! Oh, why you putting all that pebble on there? Take that off of there! Get that pebble off! <laughs> I like that one. Oh, what? No, I like medium rare, Torpal. Medium's fine too. What the fuck is this? What's going on, Yartho? I'm watching user-submitted YouTube videos. It's going about as well as you would expect. I like that one. I thought he was going to start doing push-ups. What's going on, Maiko? Me when woman. Yeah. 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, I love the fucking... Dude, this is the best fucking video. Alright, this is like the litmus test to whether or not you're a real person. If you watch this video and you don't like it, you're legitimately fucked in the head. Like, no apologies. This is the best fucking video. I fucking love this video so goddamn much. Holy shit. <laughs> it might be one of my favorite videos like that exists on the internet. Oh no. Who posted this? Hovine? Are you an insane? <laughs> yeah, basically, dude. I remember one of the worst and most miserable experiences of my life is I used to have to play video games in the living room with my parents um, present, and I had to play Final Fantasy X-2 with them in the room the entire fucking time. Do you know how miserable and awkward that was? Holy fuck, dude. I'm, I'm so glad they're dead. Jesus Christ. Hmm. Did they like it? No. That's fucked up. That poor little dude. <laughs> okay, Toa? I don't mean that. I don't mean that. It was supposed to be a joke. You didn't have to kill that just because of Final Fantasy? I did. <laughs> this is This is like... This is me trying to do a stream better than Fear and Hunger in Morrowland. I empathize with this video on a spiritual level. Smoking weed tore this family apart. All age restricted. Okay. What's this? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god. <laughs> what type of dog is this? <laughs> this is fucking awesome. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? Oh no. I like this. <laughs> Holy shit. What the fuck is wrong with people? The, the Joe Biden falling memes are almost always hysterical to me. And unfortunately, you can't build a tax prison, whereby you lure immigrants into your city with low taxation, then suddenly pump the tax rate to 25, <laughs> and prevent them from leaving with a double layer thick perimeter of solid stone. It turns out the desire to emigrate is so strong that people simply phase through walls, reinforcing the theory that even lower on Maslow's hierarchy of needs is the physiological requirement for a human being to evade taxation. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's about right. No new video for 1,000 years. What is this? Holy fuck. Corporal, yo, dude, come over. We need to do this shit.
Did you ever know one of those kids who had like a fucked up um bootleg metal Beyblade? A game called Monster Hunter. Hey man. Did you beat Max Payne yet? Uh no, I've been playing. I Monster was Hunter. that kid. Monster Hunter. What are you doing that? You mean illegal blade? Yes. Fucking stupid video. <laughs> Oh my god. Alright. What's this? Remember when you said you was gonna book my vacation to Miami because you're good at the Google machine? Well, you motherfucker sent me to goddamn Miami of Ohio, not Miami, Florida, you son of a fucking bitch. <laughs> motherfucker, I'm goddamn freezing. I thought I was going to so all I fucking packed was these goddamn flip flops and shorts and these fucking t shirts. I'm shaking my ass off walking around downtown trying to go into a fucking restaurant. The fucking locals think I'm a homeless person. They try giving me money and I say, no, I'm on vacation. And then they think my brain's broken, so they call the police to give me a mental evaluation. That happened twice already. Oh my I became God. a village idiot in this whole fucking town in three days. The whole town knows me. They all call me Beach Bum when I walk in the fucking door because I'm shivering fucking cold, looking like I'm going to the fucking beach motherfucker i swear to god when i get home i'm gonna karate chop you right in the fucking adam's apple i'm lucky that i got hairy feet otherwise i'd have frostbite on those motherfuckers this was my first vacation you son of a bitch i'm walking around in arctic tundra that would be awesome i think i'd rather go there than actual miami oh wow Holy shit! Good God! Hey guys, Red here from Hillbillies in the Holler, and first things first, do not try this at home. Okay. Now, for those of you who whipped out my Hillbilly Fortitude, let me show you here what we're working with. Can't see a thing, can you? Come a little closer. Listen here. That there's good old corn liquor right there. Here's what we're gonna do with it. Cheers. I see that Jenny Yu is the next the next video. <laughs> I tell you, you'll build a shot. I tell you, that Red Bull give you wings. Or that moonshine give you four wheel drive. <sighs> Fuck that. Okay, this is a Jenny Yu video. That's definitely DMCA music. I'm gonna get fucking bin banned, dude. Let's see a gainer, Grandpa. No, not yet. Oh. <laughs> I fucking like that one. All the Morrowind ones have been great. What the fuck is this? Got to read the title. Yeah, you can speed run it before it loads. Does it load that slowly on this is Wow. That's fucking miserable. Alright. I get the point. Asked for a sprite and they gave me clown juice. always fucking up my order, bro. I asked for a sprite and they gave me clown juice. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> you son of a bitch. Dark Souls speedrunner, I've never speed ran anything. Not one time. Okay.
Who posted this? Torpulta? What the fuck? What are you doing? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Torpul, come on. Hey, Peter. How will I be? No! <laughs> Poor baby. <laughs> Poor baby. I don't believe this. Steak dinner baby fuck. Oh, this is the last video. We got to the bottom. Hey, guess what I'm having today? Fuck, man. Fucking steak, baby. Yeah. The ribeye, mashed potatoes, beans. Yeah, baby. Fuck. Fucking steak. This is a yeah. good last video. Monday brunch, baby. Fuck. This is what to make on your Monday. Fuck. Any day, it's what what makes it your day. Make it a happy one. Fuck, man. Fuck. Fucking steak, baby. Yeah. It's fucking Monday. This is me, dude. That's a good looking steak, too. Yeah, fucking Monday, baby. Fucking Monday. Steak, baby. Fucking Monday. Fuck. All right. Make Monday a good day, baby. Yeah. All right. I have to do... I have to have the last laugh, though. I'm going to have a video of my own that I'm going to contribute. Okay? Tolotus has to one-up everybody, you know it. This is the sort of shit that I find funny, so if you think your humor is juvenile, get ready. <laughs> Can I talk to you for a minute? It's kind of serious. I, I was at the doctor today. He told me that, um... He t he t they, they said that I have cancer. Oh, I know, I know, don't... Don't worry, please, don't worry about me. I promise we'll spend so much fucking time together. Remember... <laughs> fucking lip Remember how smacking. we talked about going to the park? We'll do that now, we'll do it, I promise you. <laughs> I have something else I need to tell you. Babe. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. Will you marry me? <laughs> Thank you. And finally, I'm following. All right, goodbye. It's been nice. Hey, babe. Thank you so much for never leaving my side. Babe, can I ask you something? I don't want you to see me with Yeah, a lot of people have been ripping on me tonight. I want to die by your hands. Unfortunate. Please, babe, that's my last wish. <laughs> Jesus. I like that video. I think it's good. Alright, well that's all of the videos. So I guess my job here is done. I will I will relieve you of my presence. Have a good weekend. <laughs>